never find the right words And there's no way this is real life There's no telling you're the right girl So I can only say that it feels right It feels right, it feels right Yeah, I can only say that it feels right It feels right, it feels right Yeah, I can only say that it feels right The doubt felt like this is just a must. Put me in perspective, I'm the deepest in the cut. Everybody tuning in, but this is just for us now. We know I ain't balling yet. Hoes wanna holler, oh no, I don't call them back. Girl, let me see you hold it down, we gon' have a blast. Cause I just wanna know what you gonna do with all of that. Right, till we fucking go. Right, I need to get rid of this. Hey, what up? We're live, we're on the uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome, hello, people who are joining me, I don't know how many people have joined me already, but uh, we're streaming, we're doing a wee bit of couldn't watch and why no, I'm bored, I just to say do why these Q&A things and while we're at the, while we're at it, we'll uh, keep my couldn't up on the side, keep an eye on it, I've got the scores down the bottom, I've got my shit at the side here, you can have a look at my accumulators and my score to wins, we'll talk through, I'll discuss why I put off oh, for fuck's sake, Ross County are beating Aberdeen 1-0. Two minutes in, this is the point. Oh, for fuck's sake, right? That's one team already done on both accumulators. The good thing is, I've got Ross County on a scoring win. Uh, so now I've got Aberdeen and both teams to score and win. So now if Aberdeen go and score two, at least both teams have scored a goal. So I suppose that's alright in that, in that aspect. But if Aberdeen go and get beat after Ross County, I'll fucking kill myself. Surely to Christ, they won't get beat after Ross County. I was going to back Bristol there at 1 0 in one minute. Bobby Reid scoring for the second week in a row for Bristol there. I was going to I was going to have them on, but uh, why not? Anyway, hello ladies and gentlemen, I'll keep up with the chat in a moment, just want to introduce the streaming shit, get stuff like that done and explain what is happening. So, I've done a lot of these Q&A kind of streams in the past, people have enjoyed it, just kind of discussing with the chat. Um, and I, I've decided to go do that, but I had a twist in where I just look at my, my accumulator, you can see me go through the agony uh, and such. And aye, my scores for my games are on the screen. This is the new Soccer Saturday, says Amir Khan's wife here. I, I would be watching True Geordie's new fucking Soccer Saturday thing now if it wasn't for me coming up with this and doing this. So, this stream will probably just go on uh, for as long. And it was, is there a goal there? No, I thought it was a goal. I've got Soccer Saturday on over here. Um, but aye. Uh, I'm just, uh, well, this will go on as long as my coupons are fucked, probably. Until I get bored uh, of the fact that my coupons are getting absolutely pumped. Anyway... Sean are and I hope to Christ it does pay out. So before we start discussion shit in the chat and do it, how many how many people are actually here? That's what I want to know. Oh fucking I'm only like thirty people right now. Who cares? That's I'm no I'm no fucking bothered. I'm no if you, uh, last fucking two videos ago that blew up, didn't it? Hundred and ten thousand views. Fuck me, did not expect that <laughs> yeah, that blew up. But anyway, so last week if nobody saw my Twitter, if nobody follows me on Twitter, I had one coupon on last week, I was gonna put two on, but I didn't. I only put on two pound coupons every week. Uh Rangers are up one that uh, Rangers are up one nil. There you go. And Alfredo Morelos has put Rangers up one nil against Hibbs. Three minutes in. I feel like it's fucked already. <laughs> <laughs> my teams are already getting beat, um, but I, I've decided to be adventurous with the zone. But we're going to discuss my coupon in a minute, and then we'll come and discuss uh, everything in the the chat here. But last week on Twitter, I put up my coupon. Uh, I had six teams on. I always do six teams in my accumulator, uh, and I got five. I, I always just do three o'clock kickoffs, and I thought Aston Villa and Hull was a three o'clock kickoff. Turns out it wasn't. But I got my five games up for my three o'clock, so I was five at five. All I had today was wait for Aston Villa to win. They go and draw one each with fucking Hull after taking a 1-0 lead and missed three sitters as well. So I was humped to 120 quid last week. This week we've got 280 quid on the line. So talk about each game. Everton and Stoke. Everton should be comfortably beating Stoke in my eyes. Um, I, I mean, they've improved so much as a team that they, 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 should, be, they should be beating them. 
Uh, and Stoke haven't really improved them eyes. So Everton should be winning there. West Brom and Bournemouth. West Brom, quite a boring team. Bournemouth and a better team, I would say. But because it's at uh, the Hawthorns, I feel like it should be swaying in West Brom's way to get a win. Leeds to beat Preston. I think that's quite self explanatory Leeds are a better squad last year. They bottled just at the last minute getting into the playoffs. And they're a much better team. They should be beating Preston. Same with Wolves and Derby. Wolves are away from home. But they, they're a team who should be getting promoted. They won comfortable last week. Uh, so Wolves have got in there. And then Aberdeen to beat Ross County. And I must my, my wild card was uh, Hibs to beat Rangers which has not gone well Dunfermline are beating Inverness 1-0 just to let people know uh, but aye Hibs to beat Rangers is my wild card right now not going to plan uh, not my man see Rangers forever hello you'll be enjoying that won't you you'll be, you'll be enjoying the result right now hopefully Hibs managed to pull it back but then on my score to win uh, sorry my both teams to score and win I've got Everton West Brom Palace uh, Wolves Aberdeen St Johnson so roughly the same but uh, I've switched up a couple of teams, brought in St. Johnson, brought in uh, Crystal Palace as well. Hopefully Huddersfield managed to grab a goal since it's the first game in the Premier League. Where well, I've got the scores up, my scores that I need to keep an eye on. But uh, aye, if you want to like, subscribe, all that good shit, I would much appreciate it. Also, you can donate through Super Chat and like below if you want to do that. Hopefully, you don't need to donate. My eight fucking grand accumulator will come up. Um, but, uh, you know... Uh, I'm never going to wear a coupon this year. We'll t if people enjoy this, we might make it quite often. But hello to everybody in the chat. What's, what is it with my new t pr Twitter profile pic? Well, I just wanted to change it up. I was scrolling through my phone for funny photos. And I found my first... That was my first ever day in secondary school. And uh, I... So, no... You know, it's, it's, it's lovely. I was such a... Such a fucking... I was like a balloon, wasn't I? Such a balloon. But uh, if you just want to bring up any points of discussion... Uh, and shit like that, then... Feel free in the chat, Ryan. The Dream Team League pin isn't working, right? I'll go and put the pin into the chat for you, Mr. Some Scottish Guy. And we'll see if you can get it working. If you don't get it working, then fuck knows. Uh, but aye, uh, if you've got any points of discussion, any questions or shit, let me know. And we'll kind of talk away while I keep an eye on the scores as well. Uh, Hull are beating Button 1-0. I should have had them on. I mean, why did I not put on Hull to beat Button? That's like... Celtic playing Hamilton to be honest uh, right I'm going to go and get this league pin and put it in the chat for anybody who does want to join the Ryan 118 Dream Team League which I'm currently sitting at 120th place um, I'll go and get the pin very quickly I think I may have put the wrong pin in the video and I hope I didn't I shouldn't have PM M fuck's sake this is C5 that's a pain in the arse this. there we go hey Right, there's the pin. I'm just going to quickly keep an eye on how many people are watching and shit. Right, so, anybody... Where do you think Hibs will finish in the league? I predicted Lee Ward. That's asked by Lee Ward. How, what, how's that? I don't know. I, I think I'm pronouncing that all wrong. Um, I predicted fourth in my video, but I wouldn't be surprised if they can push for third. Today will give us a good idea of where they're at. If they, right, they're, they're down one now in three minutes. I, I, obviously, I can't see the goals. Don't know what the defending was like. We up to that goal. It is really difficult for me to actually understand how the goal uh, came about, if Hibs were very poor and conceding it. I can only assume it was quite poor if it was three minutes into the game. Uh, but I think if they can get a decent result today, then they could really try and push on to get a third place finish. Uh, they've got the team for it, they've brought an Anthony Stokes, they've got a lot of good players and they're probably going to look for a couple more just to end off the transfer window. So they could push for third, but probably going to go for fourth uh, with, uh, with them this season. That would probably be the safer one because Rangers and Aberdeen probably... Quality wise, of better than Hibs at the current minute. Uh, Tommy Seven has brought. What the fuck was that? Has there been a goal? There's been a goal. What the fuck was that noise? I heard it from my earphones. Let's go. St. Johnson are beating Motherwell 1 0. Hey! I never realised it makes a noise when somebody scores a goal. So you just can hear that. Probably. I don't know. But there we go. Goal for St. Johnson. 1 0 against Motherwell. Uh, that is lovely because they are on my score to win, Kim. So, just go well, score and win, Kim. <laughs> Uh, Thomas says seven subs off seven k. Thank you, Thomas. You know I love you so much. Uh, seven seven subs off seven k. Should we get like a? Should we get a? Hold on. I think we should maybe put on a wee. Let's hold on. We're gonna put on live sub count, right? We're gonna do this. We're gonna put it just a wee tiny corner of the screen. Oh, that's not the right channel. That is not me. That's Ryan eighteen. That's not me. I'll come back to the chat in a minute, lad. Sorry about this. Uh, six subs away. Jeez, all right. I'm gonna quickly. Add a window capture to uh, this right here. Right, hold on. And then if I if I edit it to bring bring you down a wee bit, and then if I hold in all, see this is oh fuck, we've had done one. Who is that? You prick! You know, I'm not bothered. We'll keep this up on the screen uh, for now. 
and and see what happens. I think I now need to go and use a new. Oh, we're done again. Fuck's sake! Brilliant. That's brilliant, isn't it? Cheers. We're not going to leave it there. We'll put it. We'll put it. We'll put it like. We'll put it here. We'll put it here. Cunts are arsing a bit now. I'm not bothered. We'll hit 7k anyway. So thank you all, everybody who does support the channel. I now need to go and open the chat through a different fucking window so we can keep that alive and kicking. So if you just give me a moment, lads, that would be lovely, obvious. I need to quickly close off that and that now as well. Uh, and I will go to create a studio. Is that what I'm looking for? I fucking forgot how to get everything now. Right, no, I've still got the chat alive. I've oh, no, wait. I think I broke it. No, I didn't break it. Is it working? Is it working okay? I don't know if it's working. It should be working. Right, we'll keep it there. And if it sits at 995, then uh, I think it may be broke. We'll try to keep an eye on the scores. And uh, now we're turning into a fucking... Don't, don't know. Do I need to keep this open for it to work? I do. Right, I think I'm just going to scrap this. I'm just going to take it away. It's been a pain in the arse, right? So we're just going to scrap that. Well, I'm just going to scrap it and we'll keep the chat open. That's, I suppose, the best thing to do. Uh, plus, we've already got enough things on the screen at the same time. So, right now, the scores are fucking three goals already in Scotland. Who says our league's shite? Anyway, dop a diss. Fuck that. Never going to do a diss track in my life. Of course, a chance of me getting my hole. Uh, right, anyway. Uh, Gilney United, 60 subs. Well done, mate. No, if you're, you're saying that sounds shite, you're growing, you know. Take patience. And you just keep growing, growing. And that's that's the way to go. Everyone on sub. Mojo, mate. I'll fucking kill you. Uh, people asking about the sub count. I know Padraig. Right, Dortmund are up 2-0. That's nice to hear. Um, but aye, any points of discussion, we may as well talk We may as well talk football while we're here. Because as a football-based streamer or anything, just anybody, feel free. To, somebody says, call Callum and tell him he's gay. Should I call Calm and tell him he's gay? I just want my coupons to come up, to be honest with you. I want money. I, I've got a holiday. I've got two holidays to pay for. Uh, and I need the money for them. So, you know, I want money because I need to pay for two holidays. And through a coupon would be lovely. Uh, right, I have to call Calm and tell him he's gay. I'll do that because I'm nice. Right, I feel like he's going to... He's going to bust out in something not safe for camera. Also, may I just stress these are my dad's coupons. I'm not an underage better. I can't do that. It's my dad's coupons. Hold on, right. He's a minute. Let's see, is Cam going to pick up? Is he going to pick up? I don't think he's going to pick up. Don't think he's going to pick up. I think he's probably on the toilet. Ah. To Fat bastards, right. He always does that. He's not going to pick up his phone. Anyway, any other goals? No, right. So, keep an eye on your fantasy league. I probably should. I I'll see if any of my players are doing alright through Soccer Saturday. Uh, and, uh, and I'll see. Uh, thoughts on Robert's potential coming back? I hope to Christ it happens. There was rumours flying about last night about this whole situation. He was going to be unveiled today. Rumours flying left, right and centre that it was going to be announced uh, today. Uh, so far, nothing. You know, still the rest of the day to go. It's only three o'clock. We could see it. I don't, I don't believe uh, in those rumours, to be honest uh, with you. I don't, uh, I don't... I try and take everything I see via Facebook and Twitter with a pinch of salt. I think that's what everybody has to do. I think everybody believes in such stuff too much. And a lot of the time, yeah, they come they come true. But I wait until they're at least on a reputable source. And then that's when I start buying into it. Because when you go with Facebook and Twitter alone, you really do need to take a pinch of salt. But hopefully it's all true. And I'm fucking freezing. They're going to lie. I think my nipples are rock hard. <laughs> so, <laughs> just going to be brutally honest. Um, right. So you've got... Sean Aaron says he's got Barcelona and New York for school trips two grand 13 Jesus Christ I've been on a couple of school trips and I've been three school trips now actually no 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 two two I've been to Italy for a ski trip yes I can ski slightly uh, and I went to Berlin for a history trip don't even sit history but it was good Mona Hibbs Ryan mate fucking better get their arse in gear I've got them on my coupon to win they're getting pumped one now well they're not getting pumped but you know what I mean they're getting pumped in the third minute uh, no goals. Jeez, uh, oh, is that a red card? Uh, Gary Cahill's been sent off for Chelsea in the 14th minute. And there's the phone. Fuck me. Right, he's a minute. I need to answer the phone. What a waste of my time. No one even on the other end. Pain in the ass. Pain in the ass. Um, but aye, Cahill sent off in the 14th minute. 
What a way to start Chelsea's season. I don't see Chelsea retain their title. There's a point of the, uh, discussion. I don't think they're going to retain their title. I don't. They've weakened massively. They've not strengthened in any sense of the word. They've brought in Rudiger, but they've got rid of other centre backs in the back of that. They got rid of Ake. They got rid of um, what's his name. Zuma on loan. So, I don't see any improvement there. There's not a lot of depth. When they would play these three at the bank, Rudiger's the only guy who can come in at the current minute and fill in a spot. Where's the rest of the depth? None whatsoever. I, I think they've weakened massively. And, uh, I Don't see them retaining the title. Uh, and they could prove me wrong. But, uh, I Who said they need a Blackpool for a fucking... My school went to Blackpool and the teachers lost the passports. What fucking Blackpool were you in, mate? Passports to go to Blackpool? Jeez, oh. Uh, I think, don't know what Blackpool used with it, but it certainly wasn't the one in England if you took fucking passports we used. But I, uh, Sam Graham says, how did I get over my exams, exams and I'm chuffed, chuffed, yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm fit, I'm, I'm chuffed, I, to the extent where, about, the only thing I'm no chuffed about is having to reset maths. Uh, but I, apart from that, five passes, two A's, two B's, C. Not, not gonna complain, happy with that, apart from the fact I need to reset maths, but who cares. Uh, I need to shut my window. Because I, I believe, shut my window. I believe there's people at the back, uh, and there's going to be like screaming wins in any minute now. So uh, I will. Well, uh, de- hi, Ryan, mate. How you doing? Says Samboy ninety six seven. I'm doing fine. Hopefully, sitting crossing my fingers that one of these come up. Dumbarton are beating Falkirk 1-0, another score from Scotland to tell you about. Uh, right there, Berlin is class, Sam Graham, you're right there. What do I think about in Charms Volley? Good goal. I, uh, I don't think it would have went in, mind you, if there wasn't that slight deflection. Um, I don't think it would have went in, but at the end of the day, what can you do? Um, uh, it went in, so aye, decent goal. I'm going to, it was in Charms, I mean at first PT were trying to say it was Browns, I was like no, 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 it was on target. So it's in jams. Probably would have been saved, but who cares? Uh, anyway, well in, fuck maths. Fuck maths indeed. I'm not going to need it. DZA FIFA content. Hello, nice to see you. I'm on my as a top book here. I've won like one coup in my life and it was for £15. Uh, the only coup I've ever fucking won. I gave William Hill so much money last year and the only coup that came up was a Scottish Cup semi final. I hate bet- betting on Celtic. Um, you shouldn't do it unless you're very caught unless you're playing Hamilton and you shove them on to win you should never do it but being me I decided to do it I'm a bit bold uh, I put Celtic on 2-0 at Hamden and Callum McGregor to score at any time we won 2-0 and McGregor scored so I got about £15 for that <laughs> uh, but aye and Cham or Brown, says Sean Aaron. I think I'd have to go with Brown at the current minute, and Cham is looking good. I like him. He's looking sharp, but Brown is the captain at the end of the day, and I feel like he's the engine of Celtic. Uh, without Brown, I feel like there would be a massive gap in the team. I mean, he does have his off days. He does really go missing a lot, but we're going to see that with every player. Every player goes missing at points, and you can't, you can't expect them to play quality 100% of the time, but he is the captain, uh, and he's, you know, you've got to expect him to do well. When he can, you've got to expect him to have his bad days as well. So I'd I'd prefer Brown, but over time, you know, I'll end up saying in Cham uh, if he consistently performs. I'd like to see him turn out to be like big Victor Wanyama or something like that. He just I feel like he could be that sort of player. No score updates for my kittens anyway right now. If they are in no no, I kill myself. Do I think Hayes and Forrest are good enough for the Champions League? Says Bailey Sweeney. I think we can only there's only one way that Hayes. Can we get, there's a goal, there's a goal. Well, St. Johnson are beating Motherwell 2 0. Get it, there we go. St. Johnson 2, Motherwell 0. I should put them in my normal cup and say the Hibs or Aberdeen wanted to because Aberdeen are getting beat. Uh, no, I just need Motherwell to score. I just need Motherwell to score a goal. Um, but there we go. St. Johnson 2, Motherwell 0. I don't know who the scorers are, but there you go if you're interested in that for all the Scottish football fans. Um, but what was it? Well, Hayes, there's only one way that he can be good enough for Champions League, and that's to give him the time. To uh, become a Champions League player, give him well, a Champions League quality player for Celtic. He's not getting the time in the park, and he probably won't get the time in the park to develop into that sort of player. And I feel like he's got it in him if we give him the time. I'd be starting them over Forrest. I don't think Forrest is good enough for the Champions League. And the difference between Hayes and Forrest for me, yeah, Forrest might be younger, but Forrest has had his time at Celtic to develop enough. He's been in the first team five five years now, uh, and Hayes is is should be getting chances over him in my opinion. I don't want to be too critical of James Forrest. I feel like I always am too critical of James Forrest, but it does it makes it hard for me. So I, uh, I met the Queen of the South right back, Sean Rennie and Tesco yesterday. What a place to meet a football. <laughs> I mean, it's not exactly a big football, but aye, lovely job, boy. Good for you. Um, that's on KSI versus the Sidemen. What's on KSI? I, I, 
I don't know. Right, anyway, I've been told to check Twitter. I'll check Twitter very, very quickly. I've got a notification. Let's go check Twitter. Oh, 6994. 6994. We'll probably hit 7k on this stream if things go well. Uh, Michael O'Halloran scored for St. Johnson again. Rangers loaning him out last week. Uh, gave me faith that I was going to win my coupon. Uh, the one time in my life that I was fucking happy about Hun scored. <laughs> um, he scored last week in like the 90th minute or something. Uh, and I was chuffed. Uh, it's confirmed on 2 Inverness 1. Um, I was chuffed. And then fucking Aston Villa go and spoil it for me right in the night. Uh, Patrick McFan says, Ryan, a striker situation. Do you feel that something is off on the team? Um, the striker situation... The striker situation, for me, we do need a third-choice third striker. But the difficulty is, who is willing to come to Celtic in the Scottish Premiership to be third-choice striker? I think we've got to the point where it is appealing to come back to Celtic now. Like, if this time last year, there wasn't much appealing about coming to Celtic. There wasn't much, let's be honest. This time, two, three, four, the last ten, no, ten, five years since Rangers got liquidated around about that time, there's been nothing really appealing about coming to the Scottish Premiership, never mind coming to Celtic. Uh, uh, but it started to get appealing, I think, again, for players who are going to be guaranteed first team football. But I don't see Brendan Rodgers going into the market to get a player who's going to come in to overtake Griffiths or Dembele in the first team. So, if you're trying to convince a striker to come here who's going to be good enough to be third choice, it's it's difficult. It is difficult, not going to lie. It's going to, it, it will be, it'll be hard, and I don't think we're going to be able to do it easily. So, where do we go? Do we dip in to get somebody on loan? But at the same time, that same situation applies. There's a goal somewhere. Hibernian have equalised. Yes! Come on, Hibs. There you go. Who scored the goal? Who scored that? I'm waiting for it to come up on Super Sunday. Come on, Hibs. Who scored? Oh... Who is it? Come on, who is it? I'm sitting fucking waiting on Soccer Saturday for Bastard and Jeff Sterling to hurry up and tell me. Come on, the old bastard. Ah, oh, it's telling me, but it's... Turn up. A oh, fucking Simon Murray. Hey, girls don't like boys or something. They, they like Simon Murray. I can't remember what the fuck they've been saying this week. But there we go. Hibs have got an equaliser. Lovely. No goals in England. Apparently your league's shite. No goals in England. 22 minutes in. But up here in Scotland, they've got two... Three, four, five goals already. Is that five? It is five. <laughs> five goals already. Yeah, the Rangers forever. I can tell you've been enjoying that. Uh, Sean Maguire or Louis Moult would be good for third choice. Now, Louis Moult is a good player, but the thing is, is he a Celtic player? Oh, it's another goal. Who scored now? It's another goal in Scotland. Aberdeen! <laughs> Things are coming up, Millhouse. Come on, Aberdeen has scored. Get in. Dab dancer, ye. That's gone well. I'm smiling. There we go. Goal for Aberdeen. Ross County 1, Aberdeen 1. Uh, I don't know who scored the goal up there. We'll have to wait and see on Dingwall. There's another goal. It's done in England. Huddersfield are beating Crystal Palace. 1-0. Fucking hell. It's flying in the goals at the minute. Uh, Huddersfield. I've got them in my fucking... Both to score and result as well. Fucking yes. Yeah. See if I win 8.5 grand on a live stream. <laughs> I'll get my boys. <laughs> I'll whip my boys right out. Huddersfield are up 1-0. Gary McKay, Steven getting the goal. No, it's, no, it's not Gary McKay, Steven. They got the goal. Mark Reynolds gets the goal for Aberdeen. Uh, but Huddersfield scored their first ever goal in the Premier League. They are up 1-0 away to Frank De Boer's Crystal Palace. And if Crystal Palace do get beat today, I feel like uh, everything I said in my predictions is going to come true. Because I said Frank De Boer, I think, is going to be an absolute flop at Crystal Palace. One called Ronald, one called Frank, one missed a penalty, the other one's a wank. Uh, but <laughs> uh, I think he's going to be a flop at Crystal Palace, I really do. And I think this is the beginning of it if they get beat off Huddersfield at home on game one of the season. Jesus. Oh, Tenny Thompson, you seen me at bowling yesterday. I didn't win anyway. I think I finished last in the first game and second last in the fucking second game. Um, right, anyway, where I seen a question. How long do I think it will take for Rangers to become title contenders again? Um, Burnley are beating Chelsea 1-0. Fucking hell. It was just a bit of... Burnley, Sam Volks, 1-0 against Chelsea. Crazy down there. Fuck me, it's sending off for Chelsea and 1-0 Burnley. 1-0 up against 10 men. Chelsea are having a nightmarish opening half here. Uh, not going well for them whatsoever down down there. The champions don't think they'll defend their title, as I said. Uh, Rangers, I think, this is the beginning of them trying to come back. We need to see how these signings go for Rangers. Right this season, I don't think they're going to challenge Celtic. Um, don't see it happening. Uh, next season, who knows? We need to just keep seeing how they improve. It's hard to put a specific date on, but Celtic, I think, will win ten in a row. But the last few heading into the ten in a row, it's going to be, it will be tight. I think. Don't know. 
it might be an easy 10 in a row for us. But I do see the last few being tight, close titles, uh, and we'll see. What do I think about the, the 7K and Ryan Wick? If I get 7,000 subscribers today and win one, of, even one of my coupons, even if it's my 280 quid one, don't even have to be my 8 grand one. If I win my, my, my 280 pound one, I'll be happy because that's that's half my half one of my holidays paid. One holiday being about 500 quid, so that's about half of that paid, which is lovely. Um, aye, anyway... Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Where's where's it? Armstrong situation. Armstrong situation. Huddersfield are up 2 0. You have so fucked my scoring one. Oh, you bastards, you. That, uh, Crystal Palace are not going to win that game 3 2. Never in a million years. Hamilton are beating Dundee 1 0. Morton beating St Mirren 1 0. And that Derby. And Falkirk are drawing 1 0 with Dumbarton as well. There's some score updates from up here in Scotland. I'll try and keep Livingston up 1 0 against Britain. But Morton are winning in that. Uh, is it the Lanarkshire Derby, is that what it's called? No, Derby anyway. Uh, Morton are beating St Mirren 1 0. And Hamilton beating Dundee. Neil McCann, how long is he going to last at Dundee? That's a question to be asked. Uh, as I said, don't think uh, in my predictions for the league table, don't think Neil McCann will last very long. Could see my way by Christmas. Uh, and getting beat off Hamilton, granted, away from home, uh, still though, I don't think Dundee should be getting beat off Hamilton. But 2 0 Huddersfield. Jeez, oh, did not expect that. And now, oh, I've got a donation. Two quid donation from DZ FIFA content. Thank you, my friend. I'm going to go and read out your message. Uh, and I. I need to go and read out your message. Fuck, I need a new tab. And then I'll come back to questions in the chat. Donations do get prioritised. If you donate, you're put to the top of the fucking list because you're a fucking OG. Uh, oh geez, uh, not really the word, but my donations, right? DZA con uh, FIFA content has said, can't wait to see you hit 7k subs uh, soon, and also thoughts on KSI versus the Sidemen. What a shite. <laughs> what of shite. I hate this. It's all a lot of. Right, I could bear it for like a, a day, but it's just dragged on too much, and the fact that it's fake is shite. It's just. It, it does my tits in. Fed up with it. Granted, Rotoshaw's song was quite funny, um, but I. Uh, let's see, let's see, who am I going on two holidays with? Well, one of the holidays is just me and one of my pals, we're going out to America for uh, a trip to go and see like, WrestleMania and shit, uh, and then the other one is just like a typical lads holiday, you could say, I hate that term, I hate the term lads holiday, does my tits in, think we're going to Zante, no sure yet, uh, but I go in there, so I've got two holidays, quite a bit of money, should be alright though, hope I can pay for both, I'll probably live in this time next, I'll probably live in Sucky Hill Street, no in a, no in a flat, on the fucking grunt. Uh, in a sitting bag, <laughs> but I have to apparently to take off slow mode. If I take off slow mode, I feel like I'm going to miss a lot of um, a lot of messages and shit. But I we're going to talk about the Stuart Armstrong situation. Um, Stuart Armstrong, I can't believe Huddersfield are up two 0 They've humped my 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 both teams to score because Palace are not going to win three two now. No, no in a no in a million years, never in a million years. Not a chance. Uh, Stuart Armstrong situation, I'd say, basically, I'd be... I'd be <sighs> sell him. If he's not getting this contract signed. And I, we spoke about it in the podcast. If you listen to my Celtic podcast, the Celtic, the Thunder. Um, if you listen to the, the podcast, we, we spoke about it in that for 5-10 minutes. Uh, and basically, if he's not got his contract signed, Dundee United won, Queen of the South won. Um, if he's not got his contract signed by... A week before the, the fucking hangy ends. Get him out. I mean, there's no point in losing such a good player that we could bring money in for. Just, aye, basically, that. I'm sitting here sad because now I know I, uh, Crystal Palace have fucked eight grand off me. Which was never going to come up anyway, but aye. How's it go? St. Johnson 2, Motherwell 1. Get in, Motherwell, you've scored. That's good. They're on my fucking score. It doesn't matter anyway because Palace are going to fuck it. But a goal at uh, uh, McDermott Park, St. Johnson 2, Motherwell 1. A goal pulled back there. Right, I'm trying to catch up back with the chat. I do, Connor Mullen, I do. Um, uh, let's see. What am I thinking about the party? We spoke about the party situation earlier in the stream. Basically, I just hope he signs. We need to wait and see what happens there. Mojo67, when is the next podcast? Now, this is where I'm, I'm confused on when to do the next podcast. I want to try and keep it weekly. Which means I should be doing one on Monday, uh, but at the same time, I feel like it would be quite stupid if I leave it to be, uh, if I don't. I should. I feel like I, be sh I should be doing it after the Astana game, uh, so we can talk about the performance in the Astana game and our odds and getting through to the next uh, to the group stage of Champions League. So I don't know. I'll either be Monday or Thursday, one of the two days. 
it's going to be probably so I, I keep your eyes out then I suppose uh, for the next podcast Astro says more than the Crystal Palace they'd fucking hump me I ain't grand here because right now things aren't too unrealistic there's a goal in England West Brom 1 Bournemouth 0 Nero McCutton get in West Brom 1 Bournemouth 0 try to see Andy Rose scored the goal for Motherwell there Lovely job, boy. I feel like I need that. You know, I can't wait. And I can't wait for the day I move out and I can have my own like office and I can actually sit down and, and have cunts with me and we can actually discuss and have a desk. Like, the, the true job of the podcast is the perfect way. Like, I'm not going over the top fancy with fucking screens and all that behind me. Just just even a table uh, with mics just to be all nice and shit. Uh, it'll be lovely. I can't wait for that. Um. Somebody says Friday every week for the podcast. That would probably be a suitable. That was Sean Aaron say that. That would probably be a suitable, a suitable thing to do. Uh, but the scores. Let's quickly run through the scores and all my cutting the games we care about. We've got two 0 Huddersfield right now. This is half an hour into the game. Two 0 Huddersfield. 0 0 Everton. Stoke. One 0 West Brom. 0 0 in the two Championship games between Derby, Wolves, Leeds, and Preston. And then a lot of goals flying in in Scotland. Rangers one, Hibs one, Ross County one, Aberdeen one, and St Johnson two, Motherwell one. Aye, lovely job, boy. Good shit. Uh, should have put Man City over Crystal Palace. I would have asked, but I go for the three o'clock games because I learned my lesson last week. I hate having to wait because if you get all your games up, then you're like, oh, come on. And then the fuck you yeah, uh, in the late game. So, Chelsea are fucking you, yeah, Bailey. They're probably fucking a lot of people. Yeah, the Coutons right now, they'll be the Coutons buster this week. Um, getting people on the laugh, Burnley. I, was, I didn't want to put Chelsea on. I, 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 I was right. I was right. Uh, right, anyway. Got a suggestion for FIFA 18, do a player career, says Connor Mullen. I want to do a player career. I was actually, a lot of people wanted to make day one this year, but I just feel like career mode, it's dying. Career mode, it's, it's at the point of year, FIFA's dead. Uh, next month, it'll be back alive again, it'll be rising for the dead. Uh, but at the current minute and moment in time, uh, the current moment in time, uh, the Red Bull loops in career. I don't even know when I'm going. There's a goal! Wolves up 1 0. Get in, you dancer, you. Oh, come on, £280, mate. £280, come on, just give me that. I mean, for £280, I need Everton to go and score. West Brom are currently doing alright, Wolves are doing alright, Aberdeen are drawing, and Hibs are drawing. Not not too unrealistic for my first cutting. It takes a miracle for Crystal Palace now. They need a goal before half time at least. But uh, 1 0 Wolves against Derby. Uh, this is like a Sky Sports studio. I want a Sky Sports studio, man. <laughs> That is the dream. But a player career I would love to do. I'd also like to make it entertaining that I could bring in other things. Like, you know, you see a lot of people do the stuff they bring like GTN. Yeah, not quite that extent, but I'd love to like just, you know, make it entertaining. And it's not just me playing the games, bring in some stuff. Sweet about 6996. Sub 7k, almost there. Almost there. Uh, Liverpool game says specs. Fuck me. What a. I was so happy. But Liverpool are just a shocking team at defending. What an awful defence they have got. They're awful at defending. They've got an awful defence. Um, really a shambles to Nelly that's off that They need Virgil van Dijk pronto. They need him pronto. Um, Padraig McFadden, would you do Stuart Armstrong to Southampton for £5 million and Shane Long? Without a shadow of a doubt, Padraig. I'd take that easily. Because Shane Long can play as a striker and drop into a centre-forward kind of position. Better player than Stuart Armstrong, maybe. But five million and Shane Long without a shadow of a doubt, Padraig. I'd take that in a heartbeat. In a heartbeat. Um, West Ham, bad transfer window in your opinion. I'm your can's wife. I couldn't... No, I disagree. I think West Ham have been very good in the transfer window. They've brought in five signings. Joe Hart on loan, right? I don't think... I think Joe Hart's incredibly overrated. Uh, I don't think he's that great. Um, I, I, on loan, though, for West Ham, potentially... Going to help them this season. Chicharito, a magnificent signing. It's a different, it's a change for West Ham. For years, they've been relying on Sacco and Carroll, the likes of strikers like them, big guys who just head the ball. But they've now got somebody who can nip in behind, carry the ball, do a lot more. Uh, he's pacey, he's dangerous, uh, and he's a Premier League experienced striker. He's played for the best. He's played for Man United. He's played for Real Madrid. He's played for the two big, biggest teams in the world. Um, oh, you said best. Ah, I'm your can's wife. I can't read. How that pass English? <laughs> Thank you for correcting me. Aye, but best transfer went straight. Well, my rant's done. You've, I, I read that wrong. So sorry. <laughs> uh, aye, one of the best. I don't think. I think the best transfer window, personally for me, is Everton. Uh, we'll see what happens when the two come into when they come into uh, any use. We'll see how West Ham play tomorrow. We'll see how Everton get on today. It's between the two for me. Aye, I'd say you're, they're up there. Uh, not not the best in my opinion. I still think Everton have had the best, but up there. 
Sorry for getting that wrong, though. I'm your can's wife. What a name. Uh, right. Your name should be Sevco Forever. I take it as targeted towards Rangers Forever. Fair enough. Uh, oh, he does need to... Somebody said, Bolt. Yeah, Rangers Forever's always in the channel. He's a good guy, right? Just because he supports the ranked team, right? Doesn't matter. Just, he's fine. Good man. I'll, 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 I do my best to back these folk up. Him and, and Luke Randall, they're always here. Rangers 72 and all. They're always about... I, I, I love all my subs. Not as you know the Rangers ones as much. <laughs> Feel bad for Snodgrass, but I Snodgrass don't know how he's going to fare in West Ham. Will he get into the team? Don't know. Uh, he's a he's a good player, but um, I don't know if he's going to fare well at West Ham. Uh, what do you think we can get for Armstrong? In all honesty, three million max. I don't see any team paying five. Right, well, five million absolute max. Where five million tops, without a shadow of a doubt, we're not going to get any more than five million, without a doubt. But I see realistically we're just going to get 3 million. Um, which, to me, is fair. But at the same time, if we keep him another year, if he decides to sign a contract, we can easily he can easily double his value. I, but what I see happening to Stuart Armstrong is, and it's going to happen, I think. I just Right now, the team that are being linked with him the most is Southampton, according to the papers. You can take that with a pinch of salt if you like. I'm fucking freezing. I'm getting goosebumps. What is, what is wrong, man? I'm cold. Uh, but I... Right now, the team, Southampton. I'm going to be honest in saying I don't think he's going to break into the Southampton team. The first team. I feel like he's got the capability, but I just don't see it happening. And what I think is going to happen from that is he's going to spend a lot of time in the bench. And there's going to be no way back to Celtic for him. I don't think Celtic will take him back. So that's Celtic going to win day. And he's going to end up having a career done in the Championship in England. Which, if I was a football player, right, money at the end of the day. Money is better than the Championship than you get at Celtic and Rangers. Personally, I wouldn't want to play for Rangers, but if I was a football player that was neutral to the old firm, I would rather play for Celtic and Rangers over... If I was neutral, as a Celtic fan, I'd never put on a Rangers top, never in a million years, but if I was neutral to the old firm, I'd play for the old firm teams over any championship team without a shadow of a doubt. It's just the money that's the difference. So I'd feel sorry for Armstrong if he goes to Southampton, wastes away in the bench and gets a move to the championship, becomes irrelevant, when he could have been up here being a cult hero to Celtic fans playing in a Champions League every season. Ryan Jack, red card for Rangers. Jeez, oh, I've just seen that. Oh, come on, Hibs. Come on, Hibs can get this now. Hamilton have beaten Dundee 2-0. They got through in the cup, Dundee, I suppose, which is right now probably helping Neil McCann. But no, the best of starts to the season. We've got about five minutes to half time. Huns down to ten men, as just seen for Christopher McDade. Uh, Ryan Jack off. Right, Hibs better take advantage of that uh, and, and go and win the game. Uh, but in it, uh, or he could play well and go to Liverpool. I'm your can's wife, you make a very valid point. He could play well, go to Liverpool, as a lot of Southampton players do. Um, and, and it really uh, it really comes down to, to how he plays, obviously. Because he could go and... I never see him playing for a top four side, like Chelsea, Man United, Man City. Liverpool's the highest I'd ever see him going to. Will he? I don't know. Won't he? I think he should stay in the field. Astro, I do remember you had to put on a Huns top on Lucky and uh, play you done for drama. Felt sorry for you, I was... Blessing you for, for the audience watching. Uh, Ryan, your sub count is fucked up. Oh, okay, well, we'll eventually, we'll eventually hang you. Uh, Sean Aaron says, if, if Rangers lose, call, I need a new chair. I want a new chair badly. This squeaks far too much, but uh, I think if I ask for a chair, I'll get my fucking cunt kicked in from Amanda. Because I've not no long had this. Um, if Rangers lose, call Jordy. See, to be honest, he probably won't care. 2-0 to Burnley. You're taking the piss. No way. It's no 2-0 Burnley, is it? Oh, fuck me. I tipped them for relegation and they're sitting winning at Stamford Bridge 2-0 in the first game. I'm waiting for it to come up if it's 2-0 Burnley. Hold on. If I'm tell if it's 2-0 Burnley, I'm waiting for it to come up on Soccer Saturday in the wee the wee bit. It is Jesus Christ. 2-0 to Burnley on game one of the season. They have humped so many coupons across Britain this weekend. Unbelievable. Burnley 2 Chelsea nil. Not the best way to start your title defence. But you've got to remember, Chelsea started poorly last season until they figured it out tactically. And uh, they, then they went and won the, t the title quite comfortably. But Burnley 2, Chelsea 0. Apparently it's 2-1 to Hibs. Somebody said... Is it? It's 2-1 to Burnley! <laughs> Come on! Get up, yous! 2-1 Hibs! On yous go! I knew I should have backed yous. Oh, they're going to fucking lose now. <laughs> but lovely job, we. Get in. Hibs to Rangers 1, Rangers also down to 10 men, my coupon, my 290 quid one is looking, is looking good, 
is looking very good. Right now, West Brom are winning, Wolves are winning, Hibs are winning, Aberdeen are drawing one each. Um, we need Leeds to score a fucking goal. Uh, we need Everton to score a goal. And £280 could be coming our way. Yes! Come on, I was a loud yes. I've probably burst a few eardrums there. <laughs> Rangers forever, where are you? Come on. Come on out, Rangers. <laughs> Come on. I'll, I'll be nice to you. Come on. Just just say just say something. Just give me your opinion on what's happening at the minute. <laughs> um, aye. Four Chelsea players in your dream team. Rest in peace. Got one your dream team. Rest in peace to you. De Gea is the safe one to go for as a goalkeeper, probably. 2-1 Hibs, you fucking dancer. Get a new one in, you beautiful ginger bastard. Anyway, yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm your can's wife says I see KT KT leaving next summer I don't um, it's, there will be bids flying in from no doubt about it people will want them but I feel like Kieran, and I'm hoping right and saying I feel like Kieran Tierney's heart and his loyalty is with Celtic for at least another two seasons three seasons and I think he'll see his development as key rather than going for the big money move I feel like He'll just be smart and saying, and I feel I hope I'm right in saying he's one of the players who'll go, I don't need that fucking 50 grand a week. I'm happy, I'm so happy here. Cardoso scoring her own goal for Rangers. Our Rangers fans were piping up about him last week, weren't they? Oh, Cardoso's this, that. Aye, he scored her own goal. Get up, he's... Oh, come on, Hibs. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm happy. I'm fucking happy. There we go. Get in. I knew I should have backed Hibs. I knew it. Uh, right now, though, Crystal Palace, get your arse out. Score three goals. And who knows? But aye. Uh, <clears throat> lovely. Uh, any discussion to go on about KT? I don't see him leaving, though. Back to that. I don't see him leaving uh, in the next season or two. Hopefully he stays. Hopefully his heart is with the team, and I feel like it is. I'm quickly going to go up and get another Google Chrome tab started for a minute. So just give me a moment. Um, see, give me a moment. Lovely job of stuff. 60 people watching. Thank you for all coming along at the current minute. I appreciate all yous. Just want to see what the quality is like. Can you just read the scores on that? You can. Beautiful. Oh, things are going well. I'm loving this. I'm loving this. 81 subs today. Fucking hell. Love yous all, man. Um, right. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Anybody got anything to bring up? Is it actually 3-0 free, free Burnley? Fucking hell. What the hell is happening to now? What? Three nil, but I've got to go and go and go to my football chat. There with my pals and fuck me, they have humped coupons. What? What? The fuck? I'm I'm shocked. Three nil to Burnley. I hate Chelsea. Get up them. <laughs> um, fuck me. That's that's massive. Albion Rovers one, Queens Park one. Three. 3-0 Burnley. Hold on, I need to check my... Have I hit 7k? Have I hit it? I don't know. We'll check in a minute. <laughs> I care more about seeing the fucking score with Burnley than 7k subs, man. I can't believe this. Unbelievable stuff. Chelsea have crumbled on game one of the season. Game one of the season. I want to check my Super 6 because I think I said 4-0 Chelsea. And all me and my... Pa Callum, if you've watched the streams regularly, you'll know Big Callum. Uh, Big Callum McKenzie. He... he <laughs> I'll quote him. I think it was along the lines of, of Burnley are just going to get slapped red raw. Their arse will be red raw. It'll be, it'll be awful. And uh, no, the other way about. I can't, I can't find Super 6. I'm trying to find Super 6. Match of the day is going to be fucking class tonight. Hopefully this season's Premier League, and by the looks of things, this season's Premier League is going to be quite in, in exciting, hopefully. We've saw goals like last night, 4-3, 3-0, 3-0 Burnley. Let's hope to Christ this Premier League season. As much as I care, I, co I care more about the Scottish Premiership, in all honesty. But last season, the Premier League was so balls. It was so boring. Uh, hopefully this year, it is a, a big improvement. Uh, and I'm trying to log into Super 6. It's not letting me. Right, loading Super 6. I'm going to go and see. The the, the Burnley game is now on the telly. Oh, 14 NG, sadly. Not on the telly. It's a 3, three o'clock kickoff, so on the telly. Look at that. Super 6. Will it focus? Will it focus? 4-0 Chelsea. I had it. It's no focusing. It's no focusing. Um, fucking 4-0. 4-0. To fucking... Is it there? Look at that. 4-0 but Chelsea I had on. What the fuck? I'm getting called for my mama. <laughs> my phone as soon as I put up. Two seconds. Gonna go in the phone.
Scenes, ever on one now. My curtain is gonna fucking come up, I think. Oh! Yes, yeah, dancer, Wayne Rooney, I know. Love him. Where's. I need. Wayne Rooney, I've got something. Hold on. Rooney, the legend. The man himself. Rooney! Rooney! Best fucking player of all time! 1 0. Fucking love it. Get in. Stay up. Fuck. Shouldn't have took that. Shouldn't have took that. No. Ah, shite. My sign 40. I shouldn't skin Akimura's Keldon. The wrestler, no footballer. I am bastard. What have I done this for? Yup. Fuck, fuck this. Fuck this. We'll leave it there. We'll put it back up later. We'll put it back up later. Things are coming up, Millhouse, lads. Come on, the coupons are on. I'm doing well. Half time in two of the games. Half time scores. Ross County one, Aberdeen one, West Brom one, Bournemouth. Now we'll get all the half time scores in a minute. Fuck me, I've got so I've got to check my phone. But aye, I put four 0 Chelsea on crazy. Uh, but Wayne Rooney getting a call for Everton. He will be chuffed with himself. Uh, and I, I see something about soccer. Start of the chat. Um, well, that was a that was eventful. Match of the day is going to be interesting, I think, isn't it? We'll wait for all the half time scores. Still, I can't gamble. Paddy Power adverts. I'm so happy. See if I get my 280 quid, man. I'll pay Big Kieran's deposit for his holiday. Why don't I phone Kieran, actually? Why don't I phone him? Let's phone Big Kieran at half time and tell him I'll pay his deposit. Because 280 quid looks as what might be coming my way. Let's not jinx it. Apparently it's 3 1 to Hibs. Is it 3 1 Hibs? No, it's not, because it's half time at 2 1. Shut the fuck up, Sean, you got me excited. <laughs> Huddersfield are up 2 0 enough. Kieran, mate, I'm, I'm, I might be winning £280. Can I pay my deposit then? <laughs> you, you dirty, greedy fat bastard. <laughs> I'm on stream, I'm on stream and I went like that, I'll phone Kieran and tell him I'm paying his deposit if it comes up. <laughs> I don't even need to say it, you know that. Well, I'll pay my deposit then. I'll pay my deposit. I'll pay your deposit. I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll pay it. I've got about five, five views on all about your channel, but you just got like 90 other views. 100, 100, no, it's only 115k now. I only 115k, I need to Only, only, only 115k. Right, well, it was lovely phoning, I just wanted to tell you I'll pay your deposit if it comes up. <laughs> you Hi. Right, I'll see you later, darling. See you. Yeah, uh, Hearts getting a decent result. 1 0 up at Kilmarnock. Right, all the half time scores, I suppose, then we'll run through. But there's still two games on my thingy that we've got to run through the half time scores. May I ask who's enjoying this? Just before we go into half time, um, who, who's enjoying this? Would you like to see this every time? Obviously, I can't do it when Celtic are at home because I'm at the Celtic game. I can't do it then, sadly, uh, because I'm a season ticket holder and I'll be at the games. But when Celtic are away from home, uh, and, I, and I'm sitting here then. Who wants to see me do this? Who's enjoying herself? I, I'm, I'm enjoying it. It's fucking fun. I want to keep my eyes and my coupon all the time. Um, love this. Astro. Oh, yeah, big fat bastard. <laughs> but uh, aye. Uh, this is great. I'm, I'm, loving, I'm loving life. I'm loving life because £280 is looking, looking realistic right now. And I'll take that. Right now, I've, my coupons have not went bad. Last week, we've done well. Well, I've done well. This week it's looking alright as well. My six game accumulators are gone well this season. Apart from last week I got pumped in the last game. But aye, thank you all for the support. Right, half time scores then because Leeds and Preston is basically at half time. So, let's run through the scores then for my accumulator. So, half time, Crystal Palace nil, Huddersfield 2. Perhaps one of the the biggest shockers in the league. But you can't ignore Burnley running 3 nil at Chelsea. So I've got Crystal Palace 0, Huddersfield 2, Everton 1, Stoke 0, West Brom 1, Bournemouth 0, Derby 0, Wolves 1, Leeds 0, Preston 0, Rangers 1, Hibs 2, <laughs> Ross County 1, Aberdeen 1 and St Johnson 2, Motherwell 1. No bad, no bad at all, not bad at all. My 8 grand is at the windy, I think, because of fucking Crystal Palace. I mean, Huddersfield, how? <laughs> how is Huddersfield winning at Sellers Park 2 or nothing? Uh, but aye, that, that looks at the windy. Uh, but the 280 quid right now, we just need Aberdeen and Leeds to score. Aberdeen and Leeds. And we're fine. We're going well. So it's half time. Let's just have a general conversation just now. Half time, no scores to worry about. Um, I'm trying to relax from Chelsea 3, Burnley 0. Half time. 
Like, what in the name of Christ is going on down at Chelsea? I mean, they, they, they only lost on penalties to Arsenal last week. Rangers Forever says, Ryan Jack sent off. Aberdeen fans must be smiling from ear to ear. Yep. Peep you. Smile. Massive. They will be fucking chuffed at that. I want to see what uh, CJ Novo says about that. Because <laughs> uh, I know he was happy about the sign of Ryan Jack. I want to see what he says. I currently have 6.997k, says Mojo. We'll get to 7k. We'll get to 7k. Don't worry if it's during this stream or no. Fuck it. We'll get to it anyway. We'll get there. But it's a good year, man. 10k was the, the realistic aim. Not the realistic. was the ambitious aim at the start of the year. On Hogmanay, we hot 2k. Uh, we got Hogmanay, 2k. And uh, I said, look, 10k. I think that was half my nut. No, that's looking good. Anyway... Uh, no, just Aberdeen fans, says Jack Geo4. I know I'm smiling for fucking. Dude, it just, it's so good because it's Neil Lennon and all. And I, I hope he's just. I hope he's just turning around like that. Fucking, uh, see the cunt at the Rosenberg game? I hope Neil Lennon's just gaining at that, man. That would be class. He'd probably get sent to the Stones. Um, right, anyway. Uh, you at the game on Wednesday, Ryan, mate. I really want to meet you. I will be at the game off 14NG. If you see me, feel free to say hello. I'm never never bothered. If you want to say hello, just pop by say hello. If you, if you pass me, you might not pass me. But if you do, always feel free to say hello. Uh, keep this going, mate. It says Craig Bert in the Blankensop. Blankensop. Thank you, Craig, mate. I appreciate that, and I will do. Am I going to Kelly away next week, says Jack BP7. I'm all going to Kelly away next week. I have got my ticket uh, for next week. Uh, Astro, would you like to revisit who is getting put down? If you want, Astro, you can revisit that. If you like, you might get, gather some heat, but no bother at all. No bothered at all, you can revisit if you like. What I'm going to do is I'm going to get a new tab ready because in a minute I'm going to run down the stair and get some half-time snacks, maybe a bovril. <laughs> but I'm going to run down and get Chris or something, so I'll play some music here, the, the background for you. Um, have I got a season ticket? I've got a season ticket. That's why this would only be every couple of weeks because obviously when I'm at a Celtic game I can't do it. Um, but aye. Uh, let's see. Do, 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 do. Let's see. Uh, been subbed since we drew with the Huns at home. Thank you, Sam, for coming along. That was an eventful game, wasn't it? Did not expect us to draw that day. But aye. Uh, you sit at 4 1 1. You're not far from me, 103 CSC. You're not far from me at all. Was it a deserved red card? Oh, you're not watching the game, right? I want to know what the whole situation was with the red card, if it was why are they things. But we'll see. Uh, let's see, Specs says Ryan asked keepers if he would collab with you when I was playing FIFA, Defo is doing one mate. I'm well ha what I'm going to do is the po see the podcast, I've got ideas to, to try and like, you know, invite different people on at different times and shit like that. Um, and I'll prop, but there's a couple of Celtic YouTubers who, and keepers is one of the two, who I'm pro did seeing how the first two or three episodes go, uh, if people enjoy it and the views keep up and stuff like that, then... I'm going to probably do one with the three of us if they're more than happy. Come on, that is. I'm not just. I'm not assuming here, but aye. Um, we'll see. Um, <clears throat> but aye, on to, on to the day's football, right? Chelsea getting beat 3 0. Your thoughts? Well, obviously, I'm not watching the game because it's not on the telly, but fuck me. <laughs> fuck me. Um, crazy. Crazy stuff in there. I can't believe that. Burnley 3, Chelsea 0. Uh, and I did say in my. My predictions, I don't think Chelsea have got the strength to retain their title and this should be sending out a message to Roman Abramovich up the stair <laughs> that they need drastic money spent to keep up with Man City and Man United and even the other teams, Arsenal as well um, they really they really do need shout out to Bro50 who did ask this question um, they really need to spend money because they've not got depth no depth in that Chelsea team and I don't understand the logic now I'm not complaining because I'm a Man United fan and I'm very happy with the signing of the Man Matic um, on further assessment at first I wasn't bothered but when you look at it he's, very, he's going to be important um, but jeez uh, oh uh, they need improvement they need depth so hopefully it sends a message to, uh, to to Roman Abramovich up the stairs. Right, we'll get through a couple more questions and I'm going to put on a wee like, two minute break run down the stairs and shit. Uh, aye. Uh, let's see. Ryan, if both coupons come up, can, can, you buy me, uh, can you buy me a small fries for McDonald's? I'll buy me a small fries, Sean, mate. I'll, I'll send an Uber Eats to your door for you. <laughs> uh, 
uh, Ryan, the podcast is phenomenal. Thank you, Mojo. I, I, a lot of people did seem to enjoy it. A few people had some, you know, evaluation and stuff, uh, and I appreciate any, any criticism that it helps me make it better. Uh, but right now, obviously, I mean, I'm living here in a room myself. There's not much I can do quality wise. Uh, but like, hopefully over time it's something that grows and grows and grows and it keeps going well and eventually hopefully we can start a, a general football podcast or just a general podcast in general I love doing podcasts I love doing this kind of stuff I like hosting getting, uh, the kind of thing I like, I like doing this uh, right uh, we chill if you had Chelsea on your cup man it's humped but your first cup is fucked if, if Chelsea are involved don't blame you uh, shout out Ryan uh, your name is Ryan as well shout out to you then R14NG aka Ryan but I crazy with the Chelsea game. Probably the biggest uh, upset down there. And I'm so glad I never put Chelsea and I was close to it. But it wasn't very good odds. No, there were, a lot of these games weren't very good odds, but especially that. But whoever put Burnley on, uh, they'll be getting something. If anybody put even Burnley free Chelsea now, they must be getting something nice, like fifty quid or something. Surely that was uh, that is nice. Where do you watch the podcast? Is Cameron Nielsen? It's on the channel. The Select the Thunder. I'll explain in a podcast why it's called the Celtic Thunder. Some of you will get it, some of you won't get it. Um, but I, it's on the channel, and eventually I'm going to try and get it on iTunes and stuff as well. But just go to the channel. Last week, last Monday's video, uh, it'll be up there. The next podcast, as I said, will be some point this week. I'll either be Monday or Thursday. I know, random. Monday or Thursday, though. I'm still try to decide. Right, anyway, I'm going to run down the stairs for a couple of minutes. I'm going to leave you with some, some music. So if you give me a minute, some non-copyright music. Don't go away. Stay here. Lovely folk. I love you all. Don't leave me, please. Don't go. Um, I'm going to run down the stair and get a drink. Bring it back up. And uh, we'll get ready for the second half. So let's hope that I either win 280 quid or 8 grand. One of the two, right? Where do I put this music on? It's this, isn't it? Right. Oh, hold on. Right. Okay. Shouldn't it be long? Should only be about two minutes. Stay stay put. It's alright. It's alright. It's alright. I'm just going with the gun. Never had a doubt. Felt like this is just a must. Put me in perspective. I'm the deepest in the cut. Everybody tuning in. But this is just for us now. We know I ain't ballin' yet. Hoes wanna holler. Oh, no. I don't call them back. Girl, let me see you. Hold it down. We gon' have a blast. Cause I just wanna know what you gonna do with all of that. I ain't gotta say a word. I know what's up. You can have it all. Watch me rip it off. I'll admit it, you got me feeling hella love. Even when it's going down, know that we gon' live it up. Young shot caller, always been a baller. Know that you the one, I can feel it in my heart. Yeah, I won't stop charging. We going come harder. I can see you and I, way beyond the stars, girl. I can never ever find the right words. And there's no way this is real life. There's no telling you're the right girl. So I can only say that it feels right. Right to you. We're back. Oh, I've left the door open. Hey, hey. Left the door open in the back room. You can see a towel and a painted wall. 
I fucking love it. Anyway. Right. <sighs> hello, hello, hello. Back again. Back again. Back on the stream. Half time. A wee bit of time to go. Milky Way. <laughs> Probably won't eat that. And some coke. <clears throat> Prepared. Prepared. And that's why I'm so fat. <laughs> but uh, aye. Right. Jeez oh. Mickey Olustig's wife is a YouTube channel. I know, big Josephine. I've only seen like one of her videos, so it was one of my pals who told me. Um, but aye. Hold on. Aye. Sorry for the dead silence there. Uh, but aye, feel free. Bring up any points of discussion, any questions, shit like that. We'll discuss. I'm going to sit back now. I don't like sitting like this in the stream. Uh, uh, um, it, it quite annoys me. Because I look so um, lackadaisical and careless. But it's half time and you're meant to relax at half time. So, aye, we are relaxing. I'm going to, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to do this because Mojo requested it. I'm going to take off slow mode. How do you do that? How do you take off slow mode? I'm going to take it off for like two minutes and see if it makes any difference. Right, slow mode has been disabled. Hopefully it does not fly through because I've got it like limited to messages every 10 seconds. Uh, and I don't know how much of a difference it makes exactly, but aye, slow mode is off. What do I use to edit my vids? I use Sony Vegas. Sony Vegas is what I use to edit my videos. Um, but aye. Anyway, is that the second half? Second halves have started at Everton and West Brom kicked off, and they're all kicking off. That's it, second halves are on the way. Here we go, and they're off. Let's hope Hibernian hold on to the win. Hopefully Aberdeen get a goal. Right now, we're not far off 280 quid here, so... You know, uh, I want 280 quid. It would be, it'd be lovely. Here, Sean, don't you start taking the piss, mate, with, with, with the slow modes off. Let's, uh, let's avoid spam. <laughs> but aye, 3-0 Burnley. The top point right now at the minute. Antonio Conte, will he lose his job this season? Um, I mean, there has been the talk about him not even staying long at Chelsea. But fuck me. Aye. Rangers are getting humped, so every cloud and all that. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat my Mars bar because it's not even a Mars bar. It's a Milky Way. I'm gonna eat my wee Milky Way because I'm quite hungry. I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna try and I'm gonna probably put my mic on mute as well. We'll, we'll take bites of it so you don't hear about <clears throat> pure munching in it. You know. Good shit. Anyway. Right, if Leicester can win the league, anything's possible. True. Anything is possible. You don't know what to expect after that season. You really don't. Apparently I had 6999, now I have 997. Fuck, well. Fuck it. Don't stress there, Mojo, mate. We'll get there. We'll get there. Uh, anyway, it doesn't matter. Uh, so if Robert signs, you get a pie. And if your coupon's coming, I get a large McDonald's meal. We had donut, Sean. That's fine by me. Somehow we'll get that arranged. Somehow. <laughs> it might take years. But fuck it. Uh, anyway, uh, feel free to bring up any points of discussion. But the second halves are all underway. That was a late half time there for Eastleigh and Dagenham and Redbridge. They've just hot half time. They have a delay in their kick off or something like that. That's taking time. But aye, the kick. Oh, wait, is that, I thought it was a goal. It's not. It's Wills just kicking off. But aye, where do you for the games? That makes no sense, Ross. I don't know what you mean. Uh, Ross Bayless, I don't know if you mean where they sit or whatever. <laughs> you just kind of left. Um, you just stuck on 5 1 and Stokes the next goal. Jeez, oh, that's a. If that comes up, mate, you're probably getting something decent. I don't see it being 5 1, but fair enough. On you go, 5 for it. You go for it. Don't don't shite yourself. You're gone for it, and that's what matters. Anyway. Feel free to fire anything away. Chelsea and Burnley. There we go. 3-0. Morton are beating St Mirren 2-1. They've There's a goal in the second half already in that derby. Michael Tidzer with a penalty. 2-1 to Morton. Rangers forever says free Jamie Walker. Jamie Walker, do you see him going to Rangers? That's the question. Do you think he will Do you think he will make his way there? Is he even playing for Hearts today? I don't know. I don't know any of the starting teams for today. I didn't look. I want to actually go and look at the Rangers team for today. I'm going to go and check it quickly. Because I'm not too sure who was starting for Rangers. And they're getting beat. And see, to be honest, I feel like it's a game where John Gray, Hibs were 4 1 against 41 against Rangers. Fucking won the Hibs. Um, but what is I was going to say there? I, was, I, was going, I don't think Rangers fans should be too disheartened because, honestly, in my opinion, I, 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 I think Hibs are on par with Rangers. I don't know. Rangers need the time to improve with this new team. 
I mean, they should be complaining, I suppose, because they're at Ibrox, so they do have the right to complain a bit. But it, it's not much of a shocker to me if they do win. I, I, I've, I've been saying to my pals, I think Hibs can finish above Rangers um, this season. But, you know, it's up to Rangers fans to complain. Probably there is a... I mean, if Celtic would get beat off, Hibs obviously would complain if they would get beat here or there. But Hibs are a good team. Uh, but aye, who, uh, who cares? They're winning. Hibs are winning. Fuck it. I don't, I'm the world. Complain if you want. <laughs> they don't fucking affect me. Uh, there's Danny Sweeney HD, hello. Welcome to the new Soccer Saturday, featuring one man and one man only. We don't have fucking fat bastard Paul Merson sitting in here. Oh, the cunt that looks like Tony Mowbray that I don't know his name. Now, yeah, I went to go and check who was actually starting for Rangers, that was it. Why go look at the Rangers team and see what team is getting beat? Um, the line-up Rangers were playing Fodderingham, Tavern, and Cardoso, Alves, Hodson started over Wallace. Um, Candace, Jack, who got sent off, of course, Ryan Jack got sent off. Uh, Graham Dorans, Josh Windass, Kenny Miller and Morello. So very similar team. I think it's actually the exact same team from last week. Apart from Hodson came in over Wallace. Uh, and there was a substitution. Hodson did go off in the second half for da for Eduardo Herrera. And Danny Wilson came on for Daniel Candace uh, as well. So two substitutions being made. Risky. Uh, if Rangers need to go for an early substitution. But I Oh my god. Daddy Sweeney has met... Has met Met his, his potential his potential child in the chat. Brilliant. Uh, but aye, feel free. Uh, feel free. Anybody want to to bring up a bring up a point of discussion? Who would you want in the Champions League group stages? Bailey uh, Bailey Sweeney says. No, the thing is, I need to. I don't know who's in what seed. I would want Chelsea because I'd love to fucking beat them at Parkgate, and I think we could beat them at Parkgate. And I don't think away we would get battled after them as well. So I take Chelsea as this the first seed team. I would want Dortmund purely for the fact that I want to play Dortmund and I want to see the Dortmund fans. Thank you, EA Sports Peru, for subscribing. Um, I want to see us get Dortmund purely for the atmosphere kind of situation. And I just the shittest team in Pot 4. Just the shittest team in Pot 4 is what I want. That would be the group that I would want. I w Somebody said Real Madrid. I do not want Real Madrid. They would they would go in on this without the lubricant, without anything, just pff, right in. Batter two fucking new holes in there for us. Never in a million years. Never in a million years. <laughs> I used to think Man City was a gay pub, but it was closer to a gay pub than a football team this time too, ten years ago to be fair. Uh, Amir Khan's wife, here's an uh, interesting thing to bring up. Um, to Erd Erdria beating a broth, uh, no sorry, drawing of a broth, 1-0. Um, where was the question there? Happy 7k, is that 7k? We have 7k. Love yous all. I'll probably drop back down into fucking six in a minute, but we've got a 7k. Thank you, everybody. Uh, 7k. Appreciate it. Massive. Massive shit. I uh, really do appreciate that. We're so close to 10k, uh, and that's where the true celebrations will be going on. I feel like I'm having a heart attack. Milky Way and a Coke wasn't any the best combination for half time, man. I'm fucking. I feel like I'm going to fucking die. <laughs> right, but uh, what was I was saying? Can't remember what we're talking about. I man City and then we went. Christie. I'm your can's wife was asking about Ryan Christie. Do I think he'll get a game next year? If he continues up his form at Aberdeen, then probably. Probably will get a game. He'll probably get in. I'm not a massive fan of Ryan Christie. I feel like a lot of Celtic fans are looking at Aberdeen and going, oh my god, get him back. Do this, that, and the next thing. And then, to me, he's just going to, if he was to come back, he'd just come back and be what he was. And that wasn't very great when he was on the Celtic side. He does have the potential, though. Let's be, he will have the potential, but I just don't feel like he's ready to be a first team week in week out starter for Celtic eventually will be but right now let him develop next year probably will get into the team here and there don't see him being week in week out as I said but we'll see uh, Spurs I wouldn't even mind Spurs but I don't know if they're in pot 2 or 3 or whatever I think they'll be in the same pot as Dortmund so I don't know if I can get Spurs in Dortmund because the whole new system is it's like the champions of the top nations going to pot and then I fuck knows what happens with the rest but I feel like Spurs and Dortmund might be in the same pot so God knows, God knows. Um. Anyway, my grand's bagpipe CD was better than that shite you had on during the break. It is shite. No, I know, I know it's shite. I, I just, I don't. I, all I have, to, what I have today is just find non-copyright music and click the top one. I hate that music. I fucking hate it. It's balls. I can't stand music like that. No at all. I just have to pick non-copyright and go with the first one I see so I can get things done quickly. Uh, so I went with that. I should have just played something from my computer. Actually, like fucking silent partner. That's the music I use in the background of my videos normal. Uh, anyway, let's see. Glory, glory to the high beast, says the Scottish Batman. Well, they better fucking keep it up. Let's hope they don't bottle it. 
Uh, but £290, not looking far away right now. If we look, Everton are up 1-0 against Stoke. West Brom are up 1-0 against Bournemouth. Leeds are still drawing 0-0. We need a goal from Leeds. Wolves are beating Derby 1-0. Aberdeen, we need a goal from them. They're drawing 1-0. If Aberdeen, if Aberdeen fuck me at £280, I'll be fuming. And Hibs are beating Rangers 2-1. Right now, there's two games we need a goal in. We need Aberdeen to score and we need Leeds to score. The, the, the both teams to score and result one is at the windy. Let's be honest. You don't have the bop, sorry. I had Coke. Coca-Cola. <laughs> uh, but, um, no. Uh, the, 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 the both teams to score and result is at the windy. Crystal Palace have absolutely humped it for us. I would still hope maybe for Everton. I don't like it when it goes 1-0 at half-time because then you're relying on two different goals because you need like someone to score to win and someone to score to get two both teams scoring. Uh, so there was two one nils, we have three one nils we have to rely on. They'll probably win to come up anyway, but it's fucked anyway because Huddersfield are somehow beating Palace at Sellers, at Sellers Park. Can't wait for matching the day tonight to see how this is all coming about. Now in the Burnley game as well. Anybody who had Chelsea on this week, I feel sorry for these. I really do feel sorry for these. Uh, right. Man United and Dortmund. That's it. I would, I'd like to have Man United as well because as much as I like Man United, we could beat them at Parkhead. No chance. No, no doubt. Sorry. We could beat them at Parkhead, I think. Doing it all Trafford might be difficult to break down. But one, once again, same kind of situation as Chelsea. I don't feel like they're going to be that great in Europe. Um, so I Scott Allen, though. He's been playing like his family's been held hostage. Scott Allen, from the two games I've watched now for Dundee playing, because I've watched the two Dundee derbies, he played though bad. In my opinion, he's the, the biggest... Wasteful, the, the the most wasteful signing we've made in in, in ever. <laughs> but um, he's playing well. I don't ever see him getting a Celtic team though. I see him going back to a team like Dundee and playing at that level probably for a, a long time or heading to like League One in England, something like that. So I shout out to Cami G. I seen that uh, live stream lock. See if I, if this comes up, we'll be live stream lock. May I hold it up to one against Button? I wish I wish I stuck Holland to win there playing Button. Fuck me. Um, Monaco away would probably be difficult, says Bailey. Bailey Sweeney thinks it'd be hard. I agree. I think it would be difficult. Although Monaco have lost a lot of their best players. But let's be honest, for Celtic, any away game is difficult in Europe. How many away games have we won in Europe in the past? Since the Champions League started in like 1992? Like fucking two or something like that? We've had an awful away record. And any team is difficult for us away from home. Any team. The, the best chance we've got is probably by getting a team in England. Because that's nearer to home. Uh, we're awful away from home. And that's... that's uh, Aye. There we go. A Hearts fan wants Hibs to fucking beat Rangers. That's the spirit, Bond Ronaldo. On you go. That's the spirit right there. Um, Liverpool. You want Liverpool. Liverpool done shite today anyway. Tell that for nothing. Absolutely shite. Uh, Pickle Rick. What an episode. New episodes at the morning. I can't wait. I have to check Twitter apparently. Right, I'll go and check Twitter on Mojo because I'm that nice. Uh, I'm trying to keep up with fucking... Uh, made a goal. We need Aberdeen. Or Leeds. If Leeds hunt me with it, I'm never back Leeds ever again. Bastards. Hey, there's a 7k. Fucking love it. I'll reply with some green love hearts. Because that's how I roll. There you go. 7k subs. Love you all. Oh, here we go. Here's a Rangers TV commentator. As money comes forward. Here's Sleevka. Oh, it comes back off Tavernier. Goals the net. What an own goal. What an own goal. Have you seen that? The own goal. Balls in the net. Oh, it comes back off Tavernier. Goals the net. That commentator, love him, fucking love him. The gift that keeps on giving is keep us put it in Twitter. The the gift that keeps on giving. Uh, Daddy Sweeney says his super six is absolutely fucked. I don't mine's just fucked already. I know because of the Chelsea game. I'm gonna go and check my super six. I'll tell you what I did put on for my super six and how it's getting on. <laughs> I do play super six every week. Well, I try to play it every week. So far, two out of two. Right, so I I put Chelsea four, Burnley nil. Three nil, Burnley. Nah. Uh, I put Crystal Palace 2, Huddersfield 1. Huddersfield 2, Crystal Palace 0. <laughs> I put Everton 2, Stoke 0. It's 1 0 Everton at the new as we speak, so that's alright. Southampton, Swansea, I put 1 each. It's currently 0 0, so no bad there. Uh, I put 0 0 West Brom and Bournemouth. Don't know how that makes much sense though, because I said that on my cut I've got West Brom to win, but in uh, Super 6, I've got them drawn 0 0. Uh, but I. That, that's not coming up. And I said 2 0 Leeds against Preston, and it is currently 0 0 doing there. I predicted the goal to be in the, in the ninth minute. The golden goal was the 23rd minute. I always go the ninth minute every week, put the ninth minute. I never change it, always the ninth minute. But my Super 6 is, um, is, is, is it's not going well this week. I don't think many people will be going well this week. I, I doubt many people have put Huddersfield and Burnley on to win. So, aye. 
Love you too, Mojo. I always reply. Always reply. Shout out to Bro50. Uh, when that's like a fly. <laughs> I'm your kids. I love that comment. I'm out of What a prick, but still. <laughs> I'm kidding. He's probably not a prick. He's, he's probably an alright guy, but his, his commentary is at second to none. Second to none. Ryan Fulham centre back was sent off in 31 seconds. Jeez, oh, what did he? Must have wiped something out. Uh, Daddy Sweeney fucked me like the Coopers fuck you. Then no, that's true. Uh, well, I don't know if it's true. Daddy Sweeney, what have you been up to? You fucking big pedophile. Uh, aye, bring up any points of discussion. We'll keep going. Uh, let's see, I'm check live dashboard. 65 people watching at the current minute. That's great. This will go up as a video afterwards. That's okay. That's my, my Saturday video. Um, so, aye. Uh, let's see. Any points of discussion, anything like that, feel free to bring up. Ryan, see if I got like one key or something. Would you do a collab in the future? Just asking if it ever happens. I'm open. Collabs are always difficult for me, as I've said. Um, uh, even for like, because someone like Keepers, for example, probably has had like thoughts in the past, like, oh, let's do a collab or something like that. And people have asked me before, and I always say the same thing to everybody. It's just it depends on timing. Because I've got school, it's so difficult to balance my own channel with people who want to collab and that. And I would love, and that, that's why when I'm done school, thank fuck. Well, we got a uni after that, but hopefully, if this becomes a full time shindig, I'll have all the time in the world. Aye, but I'm open in the future, my friend. Open, as long as I have fucking time. As long as I have time. Uh, Stevie May to Aberdeen Thoughts. Now, see, the thing is, Padraig, uh, the thing is, Stevie May, I've not heard anything about him for the past three years since he left St. Johnson. Is it three one of Hibs? I'm waiting for it to come up. Come on. Don't be lying to me, you bastard. Says three one Hibs. Cardiff, I was going to back Cardiff, I know. I was going to back the bastards, but I swore I'm never putting Aston Villa and I couldn't get anything involved in Aston Villa. I said I was never going to do it. Never going to do it. And I was going to back Cardiff because when I was on holiday we met a family for Cardiff and they were awfully nice people. So they've persuaded me to start liking Cardiff a wee bit. And uh, I Pricks. Should I put them on? I'm a bastard. I don't see it coming through here. Somebody says Stokes. Still 2-1. I think you're a lying bastard. Don't get my hopes up like that. Don't get my hopes up. <laughs> uh, if your coupon comes up, get us all season tickets in the <laughs> hashtag 118 section. I think I need a lot more than £8,500 for that to get 7,000 people season tickets. Come some, well, everybody here. Oh, one day. <laughs> one day. Uh, any mad score updates? No, nothing yet. I'm, st I'm waiting for Burnley to go up 4-0. I want to know what the half-time team talk was like. But aye, Stevie May. Well, we're on Stevie May. Um I've not heard anything about the cunt for the past. I think Chelsea have scored. I think Chelsea have scored. No sure. Um, I've not heard anything about him since he left St. Johnson. So honestly, I can't say too much. Hopefully, well, not hopefully, I'm not bothered. But if he's coming back and he's playing to the form he did at St. Johnson for Aberdeen, then he'll probably be a decent signing, I'd say. We'll see. Uh, aye, anyway. To be fair to him, at least Rangers TV works. I was I heard something about Celtic TV or something being done for a game. Fuck knows what that was about. But aye. Uh, why are Rangers shite? Because I've got Pedro Cachinha as their manager. I still don't buy in, 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 into anything about Pedro Cachinha. And it'll take a lot to convince me. Uh, we'll see after the first old firm. But I think Pedro, Pedro Cachinha, I was baffled when they appointed him. And I'm still baffled that he's in the job. Um, he's been embarrassed off us twice now. He got beat half Aberdeen at Ibrox. That was our first loss half Aberdeen at Ibrox in what, 25 years. Put a Europe so quickly. Uh, and I just don't know. I obviously, he signed all these players and you had to let them get time in jail, but I just, no, I don't believe in anything about Pedro Cachinha. And he might turn my head. If they finish second this season and he's in charge, I'll clap. I'll applaud him. I'll applaud him. Um, Sean Aaron says, Ryan, I make custom football designs. HMU on Twitter. And I can give you some, I don't know what HMU means. <laughs> no going to lie. Um, explain what that is to me. I don't know what HMU means. <laughs> I, I, I'm probably just a pure fanny, but aye. Anyway. Oh, jeez, oh. I think I've got heartburn. I just even my heart that side. It's this side that's my heart. Well, it's in the middle, base. I don't know where it is. It's somewhere around here, isn't it? But I feel like I've got like, heartburn. Tom Heaton is fucking quality. He is. Tom Heaton, last season, that performance against Manchester United alone merited my utter respect to the guy. Uh, some keeper. Um, someone who in FM I like to turn to as well, actually, Tom Heaton. So, you know, I like him. Potentially, somebody who would probably love to have been England's number one because Joe Hart, do not see the fuss in why Joe Hart is apparently so good. Tom Heaton, Fraser Foster and Jack Buckland are all better than him and yet Joe Hart is still getting the starting spot for England. Baffles me. All three of them are better than him. 
Tom Heaton and Dream Team is a good... This week, Tom Heaton will probably rack up points for people out. Tom Heaton is a good pick. Tom Heaton is a good pick. Waiting for goals to come in. No goals so far in the second half, considering my games. Obviously, there's been goals elsewhere. Um, but we need we need Aberdeen. We need Aberdeen and Leeds to get their finger at their arse and get a goal. Surely to Christ. Everybody sub to Gilney. Go and sub to Gilney. Why not? Go and sub to Gilney. HMU means hit me up. Oh. Right. I, I'm not I'm not in with the hip young language. <laughs> HMU. I've never used that in my life. Never used that. HMU. Never used that. Sean Aaron, feel free to tweet at me and uh, I might hit you up. If that's what it means. I don't know what all this fit, football design stuff and that is, but if I remember, I'll see. Uh, get Heaton to Celtic. I doubt Heaton would come to Celtic, but I'd take him at Celtic, but in a heartbeat. Some keeper. Oh, daft. Daddy Sweeney, unlucky. Louise and Cante, not getting met. Especially Louise, he won't be getting you many points this week, mate. <laughs> doubt that. If ne is negative points a thing? Is negative points possible? I don't know. Right. Uh, so paradise, let's make some noise for the boys. Hey, next thing you know, Ryan keeps saying to HMU to Kito Ross and Chopi. I probably won't. I'll forget what it means by ten minutes. In ten minutes, I'll forget what HMU means. Um, anyway, Dundee or Dundee United? I don't care about any of them to be honest. I I, I wanted Dundee United to win the other night, so Dundee United, I suppose. Neil McCann's a wank, so Dundee United. Um, but I, I. Ad the lad says, I think it's a disgrace that the Champions League isn't on regular TV and BPL. It should be a normal channel without paying ridiculous money. I agree. I, I, I like BT more than Sky by a country mile. BT's coverage of football is so much better than Sky's, especially Scottish football. And I feel like that's what really sways my decision to prefer BT over Sky. But I like it the way where I feel like the Champions League should be on. There's a goal. Hibs 3-1. Anthony Stokes, apparently, is it Stokes? No, it's Slivka. People said Stokes, but I don't know. We'll wait and see. It was Slivka. Slivka, 3-1, Hibs. God, oh, you fucking dancers. I love yous, man. I love Neil Lennon. Beautiful ginger bastard. And he's gone as my phone background. Fuck it. No, I can't. I can't replace Brendan. I can't replace Bre that, That's KT. But I can't replace Brendan. I can't replace Big Brendan. So, sorry, Neil. Incredible. 3-1. Uh, Surely Hibs have got their game up my coop now. Come on, just two fucking games, man. Can I cash it? Let's see. I, last week I could have cashed it, but uh, I decided not to because I'm not a wank and I, I like to live on the, the edge of life. Um, but let's go and see. If I was to cash it the new with the current results, if I go to my open bets, if I was to cash it, no, cash in suspended the new, I can't. I? Can't cash in the new. But aye, three one two Hibs massive result down there for Hibs if it continues the way it's going. That is crazy. Unlucky to I can't remember who it was now. Was it Gilney? I can't remember. Somebody said they put five one in Stokes to score the next goal. Can't remember exactly who it was. Unlucky because uh, obviously it wasn't Stokes. Anyway, aye, who should Celtic sign the Scottish Batman? Well, Brendan Rodgers last week ruled out. We'll talk. I don't want to talk too much about this because I feel like it's a big. Topic that has to be brought up in the next podcast. So, um, it wasn't you, Gilney, mate. It was somebody else. Can't remember. I oh, specs. It was you. Aye. Anyway, um, I had a centre back. Brendan Rodgers said we don't need one. Baton can drop in there after last night's performance. I think Baton isn't the safest, especially if we want somebody from European football. We'll come on to it in my podcast, but uh, we need a winger, uh, and I feel like we do need a defender uh, and probably a striker. But three one Hibs. There we go. Fuck me. Go get in there. Fucking on his goal. Yeah, big bastards, lovies. Anyway, aye. Uh, we need to sign Paddy, though, aye. Tiny Thompson put it perfectly. Paddy. Paddy in capital letters. Patrick Roberts would be lovely. Uh, aye. Let's see. Paddy will make my day per... No, the perfect day. 7k subs, 280 quid. And Patrick Roberts signing for Celtic. I'd fucking love that. Christopher Ayer. Uh, start him. Week in, week out. While Boyata is out. While Sariachenko is out. Play Ayer, why did Baton come into the team? Because now that suggests that Baton will be playing on Wednesday night. I'm not happy with that. I'm just, no. He's just, he's been decent at centre-back the last couple of games. Last night, not so much. But he's still a bomb scale and a half. He, he, he's got the shit running down my legs all the time. But aye, anyway. Anything else? Uh, anyone else wonder how Matt Phillips doesn't get a game for Scotland see to be honest I've not watched Matt Phillips playing a lot is he playing for West Brom now still I don't know if, I'm sure that's who he's playing for last no sir I'm playing quite a while my nose is so itchy we all hate Leeds scum <laughs> uh, right anyway 
Have you ever seen any of my edits on Twitter? I can't say I have them, Mojo, mate. I mean, I, I know what your Twitter is, but I, I can't say I've seen any of your, 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 um, your, your, your edits, sadly, so I need to check them out. Um, what what are edits? Is it just like photos or is it like video? Or, I, I, I'm so like dodgy edit. All right, so here like KT. Oh, that's quite cool. That's KT one. That's quite cool. I like that. Celtic FC designs. I'm checking them the new. Uh, let's see. I've seen a KT one there. That's quite cool. Uh, is this one here made this and that? I like that Eric Fiatchenko one with a Denmark flag in his hair. That's quite cool. I love fucking Eric Fiatchenko full stop. I have to look at a few of these later. There's a Lee Griffiths one. That's quite nice. I like that. It's not bad. I, I, I won't focus. That's not bad. I like that. Keep up. Lovely job, boy. I need to have a look at Mel later on. Anyway, we still need Aberdeen and Leeds to hurry up and get the fit. Preston are down to 10 men, I think. They are. Preston are down to 10 men, yet Leeds are still drawing 0 0 at Elland Road. That is. That's questionable. That's annoying me. Oh, it's a penalty for Leeds. Chelsea have scored. Leeds have a penalty. Apparently. Leeds, come on. Don't fucking miss it. I'm waiting for it to come up in the scorecast like Leeds have scored. If they miss a penalty. If they miss a penalty. I'll be fucking fuming. Um, so hold on. I'll check the chat in a minute. I'm waiting to see if Leeds pay. Hopefully Chelsea don't pull this back. I'll be <laughs> Rangers. Rangers forever. I'll <laughs> this is how it feels to be Rangers. <laughs> see, I feel so sorry for you because you're one of the best people in my comment section. You're always there. You're some, some guy and I always feel sorry for you. I do. I don't feel sorry for Rangers fans usually, but you, because because you always get it in my comments section, I always feel a wee bit sorry for you. But aye, we're waiting for Leeds to score. Waiting for Leeds to get a, like, get a fucking goal. Um, come on, like, is, is there a penalty? Card to three, Aston Villa nil. I thought Aston Villa would go up this season. I'm, I, was I wrong in thinking that? Was I wrong? I thought the three I said would get promoted is Aston Villa, Middlesbrough uh, and Wolves. And um, Aston Villa not doing too well, Scott McCauley, nice haircut, thank you, uh, he cut it a bit short, didn't he, um, <laughs> I'm no bothered, fuck it, Leeds have no penalty, oh, Aberdeen 2-1, fucking well, I just need Leeds, there's no, pe- somebody lied to me again saying Leeds got a penalty, <laughs> oh, bastards, right, Aberdeen are up, we need one fucking goal, we need Leeds to score, Oh, they're not going to. They're actually going to thump me at 280 down. Hearts have got a player sent off. Red card, Gonsalves. And Calves has been sent off for Hearts over there. Aberdeen have scored 2-1. We're one goal off 280 pound with how long to go in the games? 20 minutes. Uh, 23 to be precise in the Leeds game. We need a goal there. Aberdeen, Shea Logan getting the goal for Aberdeen. 2-1 against Ross County. I'm going to get pumped at 280 pound. One game, two weeks in a row. I can just see it fucking happening. Preston are down to 10 men. Leeds score a bastard. When did they get the man sent off? That's what I want to know. Somebody said to me that Kilmarnock had cut Broadfoot's been sent off for Kilmarnock as well. Somebody said to me Leeds got a penalty. Whoever that was, I hate you <laughs> so much. I just want to be part of your symphony. What a tune. What a song. Right, Leeds. I'm going to the Leeds game. Leeds, Leeds, Leeds. Do not let me down. They got a man sent off in the 61st minute, Preston. I want to watch the Leeds game. Some, somewhere. I'm not getting a stream up, but... but oh, aye. Lovely job, like, goal Dundee United, apparently, as well. They're not on any of my kitten, so fuck cares. <laughs> um, now we just need Leeds to get a goal. I know everybody seems to hate Leeds, but um, let's for five minutes. Hey, Asian Ryan, specs off. Look at that, man. Look at me and my specs off. Oh, fuck me. I hate having my specs off. You're Asian eyes, aren't you? There we go. Uh, I hope Brighton beat City. I hope they beat, beat them as well. I hope they beat them as well. Hopefully Chelsea don't get back into the game. Uh, let's all not hate Leeds though for like ten minutes, and uh, and uh, hopefully they get a fucking goal because we need it. Aye, like some Scottish guy up put it perfectly. As I said, I think Hibs can push for third. I actually feel I want to go back and somehow refilm my predictions so I can put Hibs third. I was I was I was about to do it, and my pals talked me out of it last minute. They were like, "You're going to regret that because Rangers fans will come back at the end of the season onto that video and give you all sorts of shite." And I thought to myself, "I don't want that happening." <laughs> so I changed Rangers and Hibs a bit, and I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have done it. Leeds though. Get the finger out your ass. We're watching the coupon here. Right, the scoring one is done. Let's just put a big. Can I put a big? Hold on, let's put a wee bit of text here, right? Let's put a big giant. Fucked. Right. And big red writing. And big red giant 
Fucking right. And done 13. Thank you for subscribing. Appreciate that, mate. Uh, right, hold on. I'm just going to put a big giant done up. They are fucked. Like, there we go. Like that. That, just cover that one up, because that one is fucked. It's no coming up. No chance. No fucking chance. I should really keep it advertiser friendly and just put, like, no chance. <laughs> oh, I'll just go wait. We'll do that. That'll do. There we go. I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. <laughs> we just need leads to score a fucking goal. I want to earn on £80. Um, somebody asked... Actually, I meant to say that. What do I stream with? I stream with OBS, Open Broadcast Software. Morton 4, St Mirren 1 in that derby. That is a big scoreline. Well in Morton. 4-1 in the derby down there. Um, I don't imagine St Mirren fans are too happy watching that. Um, anyway... Chelsea have had a disallowed goal. Thank fuck. Because Murata scored for Chelsea, actually. That was nice to see. St. Johnson, three. Motherwell, one. Michael O'Hara and getting another goal. That should be keeping that game comfortable. And at this point, I wish I put that on and see the fucking Leeds. Because Leeds are... How long's left? 20 minutes. Leeds, get your ass in gear and get us a goal. Because £280 is up. Somebody was asking me to explain. i seen that and I meant to explain um, how it works. They said, how did, how did I do this? I just put a pound. You put a, it's a it's a pound. I, I don't put on like five pound. I, I mean, if I put five pound on, I'd be getting a grand back. So in hinds in hindsight, five pound would have been lovely to put on. But I always just go with a pound because I don't want to be bankrupt. So <laughs> aye. Anyway, somebody said go leads. Don't take the piss out of me like that, Lee. Right? If we'll, we'll see. Uh, Ryan, time to change hairdressers. No, I've been loyal to that fucking barbers for like fifteen years now. And I, my hair's always a state. Maybe that's a sign of should be changing, but no, I'm fine. I'm alright with it. Oh, jeez, oh, right. Leads. Leads, leads, leads. What are we gonna do? I mean, let's go and see. I can cash it probably right now. Let's go and see how much I can cash it for. Uh, it sounds like I'm saying cash out, like cash out. Um, will it let me cash out? Can I cash out? Will it let me cash out? Do I think it will let me cash out? I said, I, I want to get the Leeds game up my phone, but it'll have a delay anyway, so I'd get told by Jeff Sterling first. Uh, where do I get my hair cut? Um, nice little place in Shettleton. It's uh, Eusebius, it's called. It's where I get my hair cut. Shettleton Road. Aye. I can't cash out. I cannot cash out. Ryan, I'm actually patching true... Oh, you're patching the true Geordie for me. I patched the true Geordie for me. I wanted to sit and watch that all the day. And instead, I decided to stream. Thank you. That touches me. That thank you. That sounds real, but it touches me. But I appreciate that because the true Geordie's a fucking legend and arguably one of the best. Cons if you're taking the piss and saying Leeds had a disallowed goal, if Leeds did have a Mojo, you better be taking the piss. You better be honestly taking the piss. Motherwell have had a second send and half apparently. Fuck me. Uh, I'm no for Shettleson. No, I'm no for Shettleson. Personally, I'm no for Shettleson. I just got there to get my hair cut. Uh, right, jeez old Motherwell didn't he? nine men, two red cards, not going well for them at all, there will be questions, uh, this is better than that true Jordy, you spelt it wrong, it's true Jordy, not like Jordy Jordy, mad pal Jordy, like other Jordy, we need this fucking 280 quid, this isn't fucking fair, this is, this is balls, this is, this is balls, I, this is, <sighs> no, I'm not happy with this, I'm not having it, I'm not having it at all. Well, I'm one... Oh, right, hold on. I'm going to go and check my football channel on Facebook. Uh, bring up any points of discussion, as I said in the chat. We'll have a wee, discuss wee football discussion and shit like that. Anything you feel like we should talk about. Aye. Right, go! Oh, it's Wolves! I thought it was Leeds! I shot my pants! Oh, no! Oh, Wolves, you bastard. You had me fucking panting it there. Oh, come on. 2 0 Wolves, I suppose. Um, aye. Hold on, 280 quid, man. One game. Fuck me. Right, Leeds. Just, uh, what's a Leeds chant? We need to start chanting for fucking Leeds. What a balls. What a fucking balls. Uh, right, anyway. <sighs> if Leeds had a disallowed goal, I'm fuming about that. That's... Wolves up 2-0. Ivan Cavallero, one of the Portuguese guys, they've signed, I'm sure. Uh, 15 minutes left. Hope you get it, Ryan. I fucking hope it as well. 15 minutes for Leeds to score. 
I can probably cash out. I don't want to though, because that's what the that's what the bitches do. That's what the poofs do. That's what they do. Uh, watch Preston go and score with 10 men. Bet you that's what's going to happen. That's what's going to happen, didn't they? Oh, this is a pain in the arse, this, man. We're sitting waiting. We are, we're patiently waiting. £280 on the line, lads. Watching the accumulator. Can't even cash out. Go! Oh, it's Huddersfield up 3-0. Pricks. Oh, every time I hear that wee stupid noise, I'm thinking to myself, oh, here we go. Oh, jeez, oh. What's funnier, you mean Coupon being fucked or Rangers losing 3 1? <sighs> Rangers losing 3 1. This isn't funny, this is fucking hurtful. It's a pain in the arse. Anybody, what, we're gonna si sing you leads. Ah, oh, fuck me. Yeah, you were kidding, there wasn't a disallowed goal mojo, mate. You're a prick. You're not actually right, but still. <laughs> um, we need leads. We, we need leads to score a goal. Do they not sing like uh, everybody hates us, we don't care? Something like that? I fucking know. Super Lee song, but see that. Oh, but Leeds, 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 Super Leeds, Super Leeds United. Oh, they're gonna pump me out this. This is where it gets tense. It's been, a, it's been a lovely one hour and thirty six minutes streaming right now. It's been lovely, but it's getting to crunch time. Fifteen minutes for Leeds to get their ass, their finger at their ass, and get a goal. And they're gonna hump me. Anyway, uh, Waghorn apparently scored for Ipswich. There's another fucking player who's left the Rangers and done well. Oh. What's funny are the fact that Ryan looks like Kim Jong Un or that Donald Trump with his hair looks like Louis Van Gaal. Definitely me. With two hundred and eighty pounds, I can buy Rangers. Rangers losing. How do you how do you think? I, I, I can only imagine that you feel quite quite annoyed at the current minute. But at the end of the day, I I genuinely think Hibs are better. Like, I don't know. I don't know who you think is better. But I mean, I've proven it right now by winning three one at Ibrooks. But um, I was confident going into the season that Hibs will have a better year. But we'll see how it goes by the end. Who do you think will get promoted for the Scottish Championship? Dundee United should be coming up. Dundee United, I think, will come up. I don't know if anyone will come up for the playoffs. The last couple of years, teams have been unfortunate not to come up. Um, I mean, uh, I would like to see Morton come up to the league. Whether they do or not is a different story. I won a 4-1 as we speak right now against St Mirren in the Derby, which is nice. Um, but I think Dundee United will come up. Uh, I don't see Inverness coming back up, though. Uh, so, aye. I'll go, I'll go Dundee United. I don't think anyone will come up for the playoffs. Falkirk, Ben Haggart says, that's a decent shout. I'd, um, a lot of my family support Falkirk they're from Falkirk pricks uh, <laughs> I mean I had my two wee cousins there the one's about five and one's about three and I was trying to explain to them how Falkirk are shite I wasn't using the word shite I was trying to explain to them how Celtic's a better team they, they were not gas pick go oh Rangers have scored oh no don't fuck me oh, don't fuck me here Rangers do not do it three two oh 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 no Come on, Leeds. You have got 13 minutes to get your fingers out and score a goal. Oh, it's 3 2. See if Rangers pull this back, man. That'll be the fucking biggest redneck I've ever had on YouTube if Rangers pump me out of fucking £280. Oh, this isn't good. This is not good. Oh, no. Leeds hit the post, apparently. Fuck off. <laughs> I, I can't stand Coopins, man. This is a last Coopins. I'm, I'm lying. I'll put one, I'll put one to him here next week. Oh, Leeds hit the post, apparently, no joke. I'm going to go and get the play-by-play. -play. Oh, do you know what I can do? I can watch the wee William Hill, like, dangerous attack and all that stuff. I'm going to go and stick that on, although my phone needs charged, so hold on. Give me a minute, lads. Give me a minute. Give me one moment. Give me a moment. Right, we're going to get up the mad play-by-play -play thing William Hill does. And we're going to keep an eye on the score. I'll try, anybody, I'll try and run through all the scores there, like what Soccer Saturday day in a minute. Um, let's get Leeds up. Where's Leeds? Leeds, where are you? Leeds. Where the fuck? Leeds versus Preston. 77 minutes in. They're a wee bit behind everybody. Um, goal kick Preston. So apparently, uh, Leeds had a chance there. Right, we're keeping that on. Clearance Leeds. Right, we'll keep that up. Hopefully William Hill will keep me updated quickly if there's a goal. Uh, Cesc Fabregas has been sent off for Chelsea. That is the second red card, am I right? For Chelsea? It is. What is happening to Chelsea? What is happening down there? Fabregas is off. Um, crazy scenes, I suppose. Cannot wait for match today tonight. I want to see the, the, the downfall of Chelsea. I'm looking forward to that. Uh, no chance in retaining that title, but if, if it's gone like this this season. Um, crazy, didn't they? Fabregas now sent off. Yep. Yeah. Uh, put your 280 pound in a FIFA pack opening. I mean, FIFA 18 comes out. Who knows? I might. If Leeds fucking score, that is. 
waiting on that to happen. Uh, Brentford 2, Nottingham Forest 3. Right, I'll try and... What, should I give a full run-through of all the scores that's happening now? You're downloading OBS. OBS is a very good software. You can also record through it as well. Uh, for being free, it has got to be one of the best softwares out there. There's the score with Rangers. Uh, the goal scorer for Rangers, James Tarvin, are getting the goal. Gamboa better than Lustig? Not a chance. I would. I don't think so. I, Lustig is very shaky at points. Apparently Preston just scored. They've no... I would have got a notification for either Sky, my computer, or my phone. Trust me, they've no scored. And if they do score, the stream's ending. Uh, right, so the scores will quickly jump through the top leagues. So probably the Premier League of Championship in Scotland. Just to give you a wee run through in case you don't know the scores. Um, I'll keep this here, right. So, uh, the early kick-off, Watford drew 3 HB Liverpool. Burnley 3, Chelsea 1, Huddersfield 3, Crystal Palace 0. Everton 1, Stoke 0. Southampton 0, Swansea 0. Uh, West Brom won Bournemouth now I can only imagine there's a very defensive performance going on down there uh, the championship Ipswich 2 Barnsley 1 did Martin Wycon score he did Martin Wycon got a goal there Birmingham City 2 Bristol 1 Nottingham Forest 3 Brentford 2 Cardiff 3 Villa 0 Derby County 0 Wolves 2 Hull 4 Button 1 Leeds 0 Preston 0 Leeds 0 Preston 0 Bricks. Millwall 1, Bolton 1, Reading 1, Fulham 0, Sheffield Wednesday 1, QPR 1. Uh, and then in the top league in Scotland, for everybody who cares, uh, which should be all easier because I imagine all these are Scotland, Scottish. Um, anyway, right, well, it's, see, it's embarrassing that Scotland so far done last. Anyway, Hamilton 2, Dundee 0, surprise there. Uh, Hearts 1, Kilmarnock 0, Rangers 2, Hibs 3. Keep it that way. Uh, <laughs> Ross County 1, Aberdeen 2, and St. Johnson 3, Motherwell 1. Corner for Leeds, right? We've got a corner for Leeds. Score for this corner. I'm keeping updated now, fucking... Orleans. We've got it in the screen here. I've got it on my iPad. I've, I've got it on my phone for William Hill. Corner Leeds. Score for the corner, please. Nope, nope. It was a waste. Waste of time. Uh, what minute is Leeds in? They're in the 81st minute. We're waiting for games to end. Probably going to have to rely on a fucking last minute goal. Last week, Michael O'Halloran done it for me for St. Johnson by keeping the cooking alive. Didn't win it, but uh, aye. Anyway, Ryan, me and my pal were going to do a Celtic podcast and the next day in your Pro Club stream you said you were doing one. I don't know why I look like I was copying. Feel free to do it. I'm not the only Celtic podcast in the fucking it. There's plenty of 20-minute Tims, uh, Colonial podcast. There's a lot of Celtic podcasts. It's just, you know, they, 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 I'm not bothered. Fucking do it if you like. It doesn't bother me. There's plenty. Uh, 60, so why is everybody sending in? Oh, put 67 in if you're a Celtic fan. I was like, oh, why the fuck is 67 getting sent in? I was I was wondering. I was quite worried there. I was <laughs> worried in case something happened that I didn't know about. Uh, hope that bastard Neil McCann gets it. <laughs> Hopefully somebody just crunches into him. For, right through him. Takes his legs, ankles away by him. Deed. Uh, maybe those fans did. But I um, Anyone recommend a good challenge and save for FM? I like doing like ones where you start and just work your way up like through teams, not even take a team like to the top, just work your way like I went for Gateshead and who are a non league English side. I went for Gateshead to Cambridge to MK Dons to Nice uh, and then things went to shit at Nice and it's three now Hamilton and then I ended up just retiring and quitting and deleting the save because I got angry. But I uh, there's a lot of sixty sevens being sent and nice to see if the Rangers fans and nice to see the Rangers fans turn up. Uh, the, the, in their numbers Rangers forever appreciate you right now I feel I feel more pain than you me. I'm getting pumped out 280 quid you're only getting pumped out 3 points which you should have been anyway <laughs> oh no Neil McCann does look like that attack leads attack leads dangerous attack leads dangerous attack leads is that it a lot of balls nothing came for I want to watch the leads game badly like so badly Send drums for the King Brigade. Fuck's sake. Don't start spamming the chat with us fucking 67s and drums and all that, man. Fuck me. <laughs> I, now I can't see any conversation. Red in one, fill in one. Thank God I didn't put red in one because I was going to put them on. And I didn't. Eh? But instead I picked fucking Leeds. Who are letting me down here? This is... I hope Neil McCann, get, Neil McCann gets relegated. Would they be bothering? I, although I'd like to see the Dundee Derby be in the league, so a part of me does they want to see Dundee go down for the Dundee Derby being in the, the top league. You need as much big games as possible. We've got the Edinburgh Derby back. We've got the old form Dundee Derby. Uh, you know, we just need all these big teams back in the league. Shit like that. Motherwell, Dundee 8? You're joking. Another red card for them. Surely not another. I'm, still, I'm waiting for it to come up in the wee thing. Dougie Emery, 3-0, done to Hamilton against Dundee as we wait patiently and sorrowfully for Leeds to score a goal. 
This is down my balls. Right in. This is a kick, a hoof, right to the balls. With fucking... Ugh. Leeds, score a bastard and goal. Come on, to fuck. Why can Leeds not just score? How are they struggling to beat Preston? They haven't even got Aiden McGeady anymore. Ugh. This is great, lads, isn't it? This is fucking great. Anybody got anything to bring up? What should we discuss? Football talk. Who will win the Premier League? Man United, there we go. <laughs> Nobody even asked that, asked myself. <laughs> because I'm fucking sitting here waiting for Leeds to score a goal. An hour and fucking two hours of my life going to be wasted and put in the fucking pan. Full time in the derby. Morton 4, St Mirren 1. I wish I could have put Morton on now. <sighs> Leeds. Leeds. Fucking Leeds. Oh. Chelsea have scored. 3 2. David Luiz. Is it, is, it, is it him that scored? Burnley 3, Chelsea 2. Come on, Burnley. Don't bottle it. David Luiz gets a goal in the 88th minute. Do not bottle it. Come on, Burnley. Beat the bastards. Come on. Just don't... Just put every man behind the ball. Oh, jeez. Oh, come on. We're waiting in Leeds. Leeds is the team. Should we get like a... A, a more clearer view of the Leeds game? Is that possible? I don't know. Oh, it's a pain in the arse. An utter, utter pain in the arse. Because I'm just going to get pumped right out to 90 quid. Half Leeds. This is a gutter. I can't believe it. Who will win La Liga? Real Madrid. They're the best team in the world without a shadow of a doubt. There's no question about it. No question about it. Real Madrid are just... Mm, crazy. Just crazy good. That's why I don't want Celtic to get them because I feel like they would... I feel like they would absolutely destroy us more than even maybe Barcelona did last year. Um, so I Hopefully Burnley hold on there though. Uh, what minute are we in? The 86th minute we Leeds and Preston. All the other games are basically done. Every team is up but Leeds and Preston. We are one fucking goal away for 280 quid. Leeds, you bastards. Get a finger at your ass. Get a fucking goal. Who's even manager there? It's no Gary Monk anymore. Who, is it some Italian guy or something? Uh, we, we better not get Barca again. I can't be arsed with him. Nothing exciting about getting Barca anymore. I would beat them good. Okay, don't care It was in Cham's goal yesterday, Chris Morin. It was it was in Cham's. Without a doubt. The good thing is Leeds have still got a wee bit more time. Angus Fitzsimmons is 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 sure me they'll score. I don't know. I d I just don't know. You're three goals away for a hundred quid. Hope you hope you get it, Kieran. I mean time is running out for three goals, but fucking one goal's bad enough for me to get, but best of luck. Hurry up, Leeds. Thank you, Rangers, for having for your support. Nice to see you're standing by me. <laughs> Esco's release clause is 700 million you're taking the piss surely what that is crazy football money is just it's unbelievable at this point isn't it it's just crazy Chelsea have apparently hit the post jeez oh Leeds just right hold on I'm going to attempt to get a full Leeds thing up right I've got this thing up what's this does this not get you like a live kind of Come on, Leeds. 86 minute. We're waiting for a fucking goal. Just do something. Sorry, I'm not checking the chat. I'm trying to get... What I might do is I might get up one of the... I'll get the William Hill hang up my computer, actually. That would be smart. Although, I don't know if I can be bothered. Oh, fuck it. I'll just keep on my phone. Oh, what a time, eh? What a time. Everybody in the chat is just like, Leeds, come on, Leeds. I love how you all want to see me get £280. I've... Mary's way want me to get pumped, is it, man? You should be... Right, hold on, I'm going to stick the Leeds game back on my phone and the wee thing it tells you if they're attacking or defending or whatever. Dangerous attack from Leeds in the 87th minute. Fuck all coming for it though. Don't think they know how to score a goal, to be honest with you. Uh, is it full time in any of the games yet? Waiting for full times to come through on this my games. I don't care about the other games anymore. Burnley and all that, they can get to fuck. I care about Leeds scoring a goal in the next three minutes. Uh, it's all over Southampton. They have drew 0-0 with Swansea. I thought it was going to, I guess, 1-1 one, one and Super super 6. Oh, uh, what's that? I don't care. There's a fucking... What's this? Goal kick Preston. That means Leeds probably had a chance there and blittered it out of the bar. I can, I can appreciate... I can appreciate the time. Go! Well! St. John... Oh, fuck off. <laughs> St. Johnson, form of a well one. Four on... Uh, oh, apparently Preston missed a sitter. Thank fuck. Um... But we're waiting here. 
We're about to enter the 89th minute. Down at Leeds. About to enter the 89th minute. If only I had that game on the telly somehow. Uh, but St. Johnson are up 4-1. It's finished full time there as well, actually, along with that goal. So a great result for St. Johnson. 4-1 win. Hibs have beaten Rangers full time at Ibrox. Hibernian have beaten them 3-2. I knew it. I fucking knew I put them on. Get in there. Lovely result there. Big Neil Lennon, you big, beautiful, you lovely ginger bastard. Love you. Brilliant stuff there. Now, we rely on Leeds. In the 89th minute, we rely on Leeds to score some sort of injury time goal. Basically. Uh, go to VIP box, I would, but by the time I get it up, the game will probably be done. And there's delays. Full time, full time's flying in everywhere. Full time with Crystal Palace. Huddersfield have won 3 0 in their first game in the Premier League. Have we all been doubting them? Have we all been wrong? Will they stay up? Who fucking knows? Crazy result there. Hats off to them. I'm glad to see them win. Full time also, Everton won. Stoke nil as well in that game. Bournemouth and West Brom deep into stoppage time. Uh, and all the games in Scotland we had on as well. Ross County have been beaten by Aberdeen 2 1 after taking the lead 1 0 as well. Uh, and now we just wait patiently for the full time in two of the games and for Leeds to get me a fucking goal. And they're going to pump me. They're on the attack apparently. Leeds are on the attack. Fuck all coming through. Full time West Brom 1, Bournemouth nil. Oh, fuck me, Leeds. You've done a villa. They've done what Aston Villa done to me last week. Can I just cash out? I'll take any fucking money. Please. I can't cash out. Cash in, or cash in even. Cash in suspended. Oh, Neil Lennon, you sexy bastard. I suppose they got beat, which is nice. But um, I've been pumped at £280 by the likes of things. Which is uh, no good. Clearance by Preston and it's stoppage time. Full time at Wolves, we rely on one goal being scored for £280. Leeds, and it's stoppage time, don't know if any time has been added. Um, probably no Malloc, one minute. Uh, which, uh, and a uh, new person apparently in the attack. I'm trying to get the commentary up to see like how much has actually been added on. Uh, attack from Leeds. Leeds dangerous attack. Come on. Oh, Oh, I wish I could be watching this. It's a lot of balls. Sean Dyche, full time. Chelsea have won 3 2. A goal kick for Preston. That means Leeds fucked out of the bar again. Full time. Burnley have beaten the champions in game one. Second year in a row, the champions have been beaten on opening game of the season. Leicester beat off Hull last year. And Burnley beat Chelsea this year at Stamford Bridge. Crazy there. But we're just we're waiting. Leeds and Preston. It's got to be full time any minute now. We were fucked this week, lads. Who knows, next time we'll have better luck. Who knows, we're waiting. Might be a goal. Clearance by Leeds. Come on, just be nice to me. Just be fucking nice, I pray. Just give me something, man. Just give me something. But a crazy result for Burnley. Antonio Conte, I want to see what happens. Mojo, if you could donate to on £80, I'd fucking find you. I don't know what I'd do. I'd find your house and attack from Leeds. Dangerous attack, Leeds. Come on. Oh, they're just... It just leads to fuck all. Like, it doesn't even tell you if they've shot and it's went wide. It just... No clearance Preston. Throw in Preston. Oh, for fuck's sake. <sighs> Hibs, though, with a fantastic result at Ibrox today. Hats off to them. Brilliant result. Rangers fans... Want to see how they'll be feeling about that. But a good result, nonetheless, for Hibs. Preston will be wasting time taking a 0-0. They'll be taking a throw in for quite a long time there. Dangerous attack from Preston. Free kick Preston. Oh, for fuck. <laughs> Right, 280 quid out the window as we come to the last five minutes of the stream. Uh, we're waiting here for maybe Leeds to do something. The, the odds are incredibly low. They're into the 93rd minute. Doubt anything's going to happen. Oh, here we can get a free kick Preston. How much was actually added on? Like, did it say? It doesn't say. It just says 90. Plus fucking... Ugh, absolute balls, man. Absolute fucking balls. Two weeks in a row. Two weeks in a row a draw has got me out money. If, I, if it came up last week, right, and it came up this week, 400 quid in two weeks, I would have won. Aston Villa and Leeds never, ever again back them. Never. No chance. Watch this. Two weeks, I'll have Leeds back. <laughs> uh, waiting for full time to come up here in Leeds and Preston, who I've gubbed me out of 200. Throw in for Leeds. Don't know whereabouts in the park, though, so it's probably up. Fuck all. Absolutely nothing. Clearance, Leeds. 
It's going to lead to nothing. Will I be doing this again, says Jamie Hutchinson. If I'm not at a Celtic game, I will be doing it probably, if, uh, if you've enjoyed it. Dangerous attack leads, come on. It's just went away. Clearance Preston. Free kick Preston, oh, it's done. It's, it's surely done. Well, we'll wait and see. Do this again. I will do it again if you've enjoyed it. I, I've, I've enjoyed it. But um, I don't enjoy it when you're a draw away for £280. As you can see, I'm, I'm not very happy. Oh, bastards. Absolute bastards, that's what they are. Absolute bastards. Waiting for 94th minute in Leeds-Preston. I will assure you, Leeds will not be getting back to any time soon. <sighs> Two weeks in a row. Can I cash in? Very briefly. Can I? Nah, look at that. They're all nice up. All of them are nice. Everything's came up. Apart for the bastards in white. Leeds. Apart for them. Waiting for full time to just come and fuck me up the arse, man. Right, where's Leeds? Let's go back to them. Let's go back to that game and see if anybody's had... I can't even check now. It's not even let me check. So, no, I can't even check if they're on a dangerous attack. Which is lovely. As we come to the final four minutes of the stream, we wait. Will Leeds get a late goal? Probably not. Um, Chris Smith. Oh, just... No. Oh, jeez, oh. You can you can you can try a lock, but I'm not going to believe it. I might stream again later. Who knows? If I if I want a game and if I can't so on, I might stream some FIFA. I might stream some Dead by Daylight. For, well, I'll stream something maybe. As we wait for the final full time to roll in from my games, uh, which is Leeds and and Preston. Moment of silence, I suppose. Moment of silence. As Leeds, but hey, they're talking about the game. They know. Preston hot the bar. That's no good to hear. They're in the 95th minute though, so I doubt anything else is going to happen. Preston hot the bar though, which isn't the nicest thing to hear. And we're waiting for just for the heartbreak for the full time to come up. Just waiting for it. But if you have enjoyed the stream, make sure you hit like and subscribe. I appreciate you all being here as we come into the final few minutes. Just waiting for the final full time to roll in. Uh, the heartbreaking one. Um... St. Johnston first in the league, geez, oh. Gilney United, you'll need to look up tutorials for OBS, I couldn't tell you, like, I'm not an expert with it, you'll find, just look up tutorials and you'll get to know how to use it quite simply, the settings are a bastard, trust me, but uh, I really enjoyed this, Ryan, better luck next time, I hope it's better luck next time, this is going to be the story of every week, I can just picture it happening, every single, that is over, full time, leads now, Preston now. <laughs> Brilliant. Full time. Damn. It's been a lovely stream. I've enjoyed it. See you later.